Right, so Dead of Winter is a cooperative game with a possible defector in it where we are trying to survive a zombie apocalypse and do a mission. Do we want to pick the mission that we're doing or do we want to just do one randomly? The randomly selected one at the moment is Too Many Mouths, which is just like loads of food. Is that not kind of the standard? Are you sure that's random? Uh, it is random, it? yes. Now, I also have a further problem. Do you have a copy of this, Stuart? Yes. Because I did not get the rules out. Could you do oh. that for me? Uh, They're behind uh, my green screen. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so I can take down the green screen and get them. Uh, or uh, I can just make you do it. Uh, okay, I have the rules. Okay, cool. Uh, just for uh, just for the uh, especially the. Uh, start of game setup thing do we want to do too many mouths or do we want to choose a different scenario i'd say a different scenario too many mouths is a little boring okay so i just shuffled we need more samples this is kill lots of zombies i'm gonna okay. do that one sure that's good okay so morale starts at six round track starts at six why can't i pick this up why can't i pick anything up Oh, actually, that's the recommended one for your first time playing. We need more samples. Uh, why can't I pick this up? Uh, have you unlocked it? How do you unlock? Uh, Right-click, toggle, unlock. You're right. Why is it uh, locked? I think you can... I think everything's locked. Okay. I think Alt-L does it as well. The dice are not. Right. There we go. Alt L also lock, uh, locks and unlocks stuff if you okay. need to. The cards are not unlocked either. Um, you shuffled all the uh, cards during the intro music, which is uh, great for the effects of that, but then, you know, I had an echo on it as well, so, you know, we're both fucking incompetent. Uh, uh, I'm not incompetent. Production is not my problem, and why don't you mute the game audio? So, bite Because me. it's a hassle. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, round track. Where's the round track? Is here also need to alt L it starts at six so this is a short game which is good because i have a uh, china meeting tomorrow morning so i can't do a late one is that a meeting with somebody in china or a meeting about china uh, uh it's a meeting with somebody in china fair enough uh okay so victory every zo time a zombie is killed roll a die if the die result is four or higher add a zombie token to this objective accumulate three zombies on this main objective for each player that started the game. Uh, and if you, in your manual, uh, we want section M10 on page 17. But before we do that, we need to have a look at some secret rules. So one of the features of this game is secret rules. Let me just flip the top, well, the bottom one of this. So this one is the betrayal deck. Uh, so the betrayers win the game if you get morale to zero, which is one of the fail conditions. Stuart, can you not flip it over while I'm showing the, the I'm chat? I'm not anywhere near you. James, Pit could you off. not flip it over while I'm showing the chat? <laughs> Sorry, uh, somebody was causing trouble, I assumed. <laughs> okay. Really? You assume that I... That is a very bold assumption that James wouldn't make trouble. Uh, I mean... James is James is reticent to make any trouble. He's afraid of going to jail. Uh, <laughs> so so the mad scientist has to get everyone else to lose the game and also get a following of two minions and have uh, two medicine and two tools cards, but not starter items in order to win. Regular people uh, have to uh, satisfy the main objective, but also they have secret objectives, which means that sometimes they will uh, act in a way as to fulfill their secret objective. What What have you done there? I have set up six uh, secret objectives, one betrayal objective, which is the standard select set. Okay, fine. That's fine. Um, yes, yeah, so the, the, the normal people have objectives that are not the main objective, so uh, they can sometimes appear like betrayers. Uh, and then, yeah, the rest of the time we're going to try and not die of zombies and fulfill these objectives and also uh, crises as they come along. Uh, we lose the game if we run out of morale, I think is the major uh, reason for doing so. Um, we'll explain what causes morale to go away uh, at the start. So we need one zombie at every non-colony location. How many zombies do we start with at the colony? Uh, none, if it says doesn't say any. Okay. No helpless survivors either, which is nice. 
It's very nice. This is actually surprisingly easy by the looks of it. Hmm. Okay. Oh, hang on. Do these not have a easy side and a hard side? They do. Oh, you just... What have you done? You had to pull it off, because if you flip it, you're just going to get the bottom one that's not You make in. a very good point. Okay, do you want to do the hard version of We Need More Samples? Uh, yes, of course we're doing the hard version. Okay, of fine. So the hard version is the same, except... Why? Who did that? There. Just leave it there. Three zombies. Uh, four zombies and three zombies to all non-colony locations. Fuck me. Okay, right. So we need we need to get our combat on, and the library is fucked. Hey, welcome to the stream, me. Thank you for the uh, twenty-five bits for the James support fund. Let me just pop the music on as well. The first time I get a payout from Twitch, like half of it's going to James, apparently. Is that... uh, why are you putting zombies on the colony? Oh, sorry. I thought there was zombies for there as well, but no, it's just, it's, so. it's just on the non-colony spots, which is way more of a pain. Oh, well, yeah, but we'd have to go there. Okay, so we need some characters uh, and we need some roles. We do the roles first. Roles first. Please take your role from this deck here. So, chat, there are six normal, not evil traitorous rolls and one evil traitorous roll. So there's a low chance of a traitor, but there is a chance. Uh, I will stack up all of these. Okay. And if you wish not to see what mine is, I'm oh, flipping shit, it over no, now. So them. avert your eyes if you do not want to know what my roll is. Okay. That's going to be interesting. Yes, and as, as we showed at the start, if I were a betrayer, it would have betrayal written on it, but I'm not, so it doesn't. Uh, I don't think we need these anymore, so uh, I just stack them all up and dump Fine. them over here. Sounds good. Uh, okay, now if everybody could draw four, please. Um, From survivors. the survivors. One. Two. Let's put them in here. And we get to choose two of four, right? Yes. Okay, so. No. Hmm. Oh, I feel like I have to. Just yes. For content. Oh, God. What are you doing? <laughs> uh, no, do not want to get stuck doing that. Mind you. Okay, so let me let me just explain these cards while I've got them up here. In the top right-hand corner, you've got uh, their charisma, their influence. So that determines... Uh, who goes first is the one with the highest charisma and who dies uh, if you're at a location that gets overrun by zombies is the one with the lowest charisma. Uh, underneath that, next to the little um, explodey sign, is the die roll you need in order to win its combat in, with, against the zombie. And the one next to that, or below that rather, with the magnifying glass, is the number you need to roll on a die in order to be able to search successfully. <sighs> I am returning my survivor. So that's pretty funny. Want... That's pretty funny. I definitely don't want you doing For the know. content. What are you doing? You arsehole. <laughs> you I think I don't I think I want these two. And we'll put these two back in the deck. The content. Oh god, who have you chosen? Oh, have you chosen Santa? James, have you chosen your survivors? Uh, I'm thinking. Um... Oh, this is difficult. Uh, okay. Um... Oh, record numbers of viewers. Welcome, everybody. I mean, it's not record, but. It's okay. more than usual. Uh, Welcome, everybody, to the stream. Two. Okay, so uh, I will go first. Oh, that. I had the wrong thing highlighted. Uh, I have Greybeard the Pirate. Once per round, you may take an uh, at random from another player's hand uh, any card and, and place it in my hand. 
Um, so I have to be at the colony to do that, I think. Uh, I disapprove of that. But okay, the, reason, the reason that I chose the pirate is look at that combat. That's true. That is true. Right? My <laughs> second card is Andrew Evans, the farmer. Once per round, when performing a search of the grocery store, you may look at and keep one additional card. So I am the food supply guy. Um, I have, like, no charisma, though. So uh, guess who's not going first? So I have... But the pirate uh, is the leader of my party, so I can definitely do a voice. Uh, I have Thomas Hart, the soldier, uh, which is pretty badass. Excellent combat. Uh, can kill two zombies at the colony. Uh, which uh, might be very helpful. Uh, very charismatic, and... probably because of his gun. Yeah, I also had the nurse, who's pretty awesome, and the fireman, who's pretty awesome. Um, nurse is extra searching at the hospital, and actually, I need a little bit of medicine for my thing. Would have been super useful. But they just don't have the charm of Sparky the Wonder Dog. Okay, Sparky the Stunt Dog. Anywhere we're normally uh, for exposure. Wonder Dog. Wonder Dog, thank you. It says Stunt Dog on the card. Uh, I don't care what it says on the card. He is a Wonder Dog, and you will respect him. How is his charisma so low? When rolling for exposure with Sparky, if you roll a bite, treat it as if you rolled a wound. When spreading a bite effect, ignore Sparky. Okay, so zombies don't bite dogs. <laughs> so we got a pirate, we got a soldier and his dog, and then we got, what do we got with James? Oh, God. Okay, well, James started off with the sensible option and went for the doctor to heal all you macho lunatics. Once per round, you may remove any type of wound token from a survivor that shares a location with Olivia. Olivia may use this ability on herself. Nice, that's a good card in this scenario. Or good character. Yes. The other card, I have to say, Douglas, I, I am suspecting that we will see some conflict here because it is Mike Cho, the ninja. Okay. <laughs> When performing an attack with Mike, do not roll for exposure. Nice. Mike is pretty goddamn great. So James is a Dr. McNinja. <laughs> I'm a pirate farmer and Stuart's a soldier and his dog. I know. It, it could not have gone better than that draw. Okay. Uh, I feel like we need optional rule. Whenever Greybeard and Mike Cho are in the same place, they must fight. Oh, pirates um, and ninjas, yes. Uh, where is the pirate? Pirate is right. Why there. are we sneaking? Okay, uh, there's Mike Cho. I just missed him. Uh, you like Douglas's yeah. pair, though. You've got the R and Yar connection. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know the uh, pirate accent was originally the West Country farmer accent, and it was just because of some dude who played a, a pirate. Oh, yeah, James was, um, is sneaky. <laughs> James was... gets the sneaking box for the ninja. Although I don't think ninjas <laughs> sneak around in cardboard boxes, in fairness. <laughs> Okay, Stuart, do you I'm have? Very sad that I can't make uh, uh, Sparky the leader of my team. No, I think it. Well, you could. You just have to get your soldier killed. Um, uh, at the start of the uh, game, read section M10 on page 17. Do you have that? Uh, yes, I do. Let us begin. We need more samples. January 25th. As if the colony needed to smell even worse. Now we're storing corpses in the sheds where we once kept our plentiful food stores. Gods, what I wouldn't give to taste a carrot again. You know who has on her bossy boots once more. I mean, given the grouping, that can only be Olivia, I guess. <laughs> and it does no, make sense. I think it's Sparky, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you Sparky is in the lab analysing the samples. <laughs> you know that no idea dog mean. <laughs> That's why such low charisma. She's she's bossing everyone about. Uh, barking at them. Such low charisma. She's like the second highest in the game, Stuart, at the moment. I have uh, 16 I was, and 12. You have 10 and 64. I was talking about Sparky. Okay, Sparky. Oh, Sparky's a she. Okay, I didn't know that. Well, I've decided she is, yeah. Okay, fine. Uh, I've also just been dropped. Have you? Excellent. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't um, like you any. Keep reading. You know who has on her bossy boots once more. I didn't like doctors before the world ended, and I don't like them now. Okay, she this says... is definitely about Olivia. <laughs> Great. <laughs> it's nice. definitely about Sparky. Uh, she says studying the bodies might help her identify how to stop the plague. Yeah, right. Better to spend time 
figuring out the quickest, cheapest way to commit suicide. But whatever. Everyone else is excited to help, and maybe there's the real value of this little project. All this research will do is tell us what we already know. The dead come back and try to eat you. whoop de freaking do Still, if a royal highness does come up with a cure, I better be first in line to get to use it. <laughs> so, uh... What we're establishing is whoever said that is a prick. Okay, uh, so I appear to have I lost think it was both sparky. of you. <laughs> I appear to have lost both of you, and I can't see you on my Steam friends list. Yeah, we can't see you on the server list. I don't think. Yeah, I can. Cool. See you. That's a problem. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna close tabletop and restart and see if it comes up. Get out. All right. Hang on one second. Technical difficulties. Da -na 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 -na. Technical difficulties. Da -na 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 -na. Shush! I have to get the video up, please. Everything so technically difficult. Da -na -na. Okay, well I just got kicked as well. Good. We don't have to do all the setup stuff again, do we? Yep, I've just shown my uh, password for the uh, server on the stream, so probably we'll get invaded, but that's okay. Oh god, uh, we, uh, no, do not do randomize, please. No, 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 no. Randomize nothing. Come play, you're more than welcome to, and now you have the password. Shh. No, no, nobody saw anything. It's my super secure secret password. You can't use it for anything. What, well, target? It's not that secure. Everybody knows your password is target. <laughs> should be able to see the thing again. I'll send you invites as well. Oh, I've been invited to play by Target. Book. What's the server password? You know what the server password is. Stop making a thing. Okay, you're both in. You're right. The server password pigeon worked okay. perfectly. Hey, it survived. Now, so Google can improve. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I said something that triggered it. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> the machines have risen up against the stream. That was my Google Home Mini. I have pulled the plug on her. All right. Uh, ba -da -da, and we'll put the background music back on. There we go. Okay, where were we? We were doing things. This is why you end up in jail all the time, James. You're not useful. So I believe it is Stuart's turn first. So Stuart, yeah, I think we all roll our dice together. Highest yeah, that would so be I you. That my soldier, yes. So everybody you, rolls... Uh, oh, no, it's roll at the start of your turn, not individually, right? Uh, no, we, I believe we roll at the start of the turn. Uh, so we all roll, because we should be able to see what everybody can do. Okay, well, I have a four, a three, and a three, then. Which means uh, I can do more or less everything. Right, so first off, we reveal the crisis. Also, could... Oh, yeah, that's a good point. You, could you deal out... Or I'll deal out five starting items. Yeah, I'll do everybody five. grab five items into your hand. I'm just going to deal them, but never mind. Are you healing, or are you... Well, Doug had already pulled his, so... You can also right-click and hit draw, and it'll just put them in your hand. Well, I would, but I haven't, so I can't now. James also hasn't noticed the thing that I did. What's the thing that you did? Don't worry about it. Okay, well, James has rolled a four, a six, and a six, I think. Has James rolled? Uh, it... Yes, I did. Okay. I've lo I, I, two sixes and a four. I've lost my pink dice somewhere. <laughs> They're over here. <laughs> But I don't know why they're orange. Because <laughs> I turned all the dice orange. Why um, did you do that? Um, I've just been collecting all the dice. Why are you reversing what? time? 
to try and oh, unturn the orange. <laughs> well, you could just ask. Uh, okay, right. You're, you've lost your items now, have you? Well, I did. I've got them back now, but please okay. don't do that again. Right. There you go. If, if, if Stuart could avoid being a prick <laughs> for now two you seconds. you know that's very unlikely. Right. You should only have three dice. I know. I stole James's. And then he actually had the purple dice because I'd already stolen the pink ones at the very beginning. Um, <laughs> you are the worst. Yep. Why do I invite uh, Six and two threes. Okay. Okay. Uh, our crisis is... Boop. Strength of the dead. We need fuel uh, equal to number of non-exiled players. If we fail, remove all barricades and add 10 zombies. Uh, do we want to <laughs> fail this? No. Yes. We have to kill zombies. Do we want... Yeah, but we've currently we are absolutely swarmed on the outside. And we're going to have to add 10 zombies to the colony. Okay, what I can also say is I can't help. Oh. That's a good point. I also can't help. I can help. Uh, okay, if you're the only one, it sounds. Then... Oh, hang on. We haven't got the people in the colony for some reason. I don't know. Probably because I re uh, wind time. There's my farmer. I don't know where the pirate is. Oh, you've got him. Thank you. Pleasure. Uh, okay. Well, so uh, unless you can, unless you have three fuel, James, we need to find fuel, or we just let the zombies come in. Might as well, well maybe we should just. We're let not the losing any barricades. In. I've got two fuel, so we're close. I mean, I have right. none. <laughs> I don't know what you want me to say, and I'm going to the grocery store because my farmer. Well, all right then. Um, well, we're all. I think we're all going to shops or things so we might as well if we pick up a fuel and we're lucky then we'll do it and if we don't then we don't yeah okay uh and we're, we go clockwise so it would require Stuart knowing so i wouldn't put your fuel into the contribution unless Stuart finds some because i'm not going to find some at the grocery store uh that's true uh okay i'm going to send soldier jack chat to the police station because we need uh, am i uh Actually, you know what? I am going to send Sparky to the police station. That's the wrong dice. Uh, that was a three. You want an exposure die, right? Yeah. Uh, you can grab one. That it one or the one out of the bag. Locked. Grab one out of the bag. There we go. Oh, cool. Great start. Uh, it's fine. It's just a wound. Why? Because it's Sparky. Oh, yeah. So you can get your own exposure die out of the bag that has the exposure die next to it. As opposed to um, it. Okay, uh, so Sparky has made it. Uh, it's a Sparky. With a wound? It, with a wound. Sparky. Uh, how many wounds can you take? That's a good question. Uh, two, I think. And then three, you die. Bite, you oh. die, and turn into a zomble. Uh, okay, I'll go with that. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's right. Yeah, I was just going to look it up, but then I can't find it. So now I'm like, meh, who cares? Um, uh, one other consideration if we're all leaving, that means we don't have to supply any food. That's true. I was going to leave Soldier. Soldier uh, Boy Soldier, up in it, oh. I was going to leave Soldier Tom on the basis that his ability is to kill multiple zombies James, at the colony. do you want to leave so anyone? That would be nice. Uh, sorry, what? Do you I'm want confused. to leave a character at the colony? I mean, I could leave the doctor. Because um, but... I'm quite tempted to leave the pirate at the colony for obvious reasons. Uh, I'm less happy leaving the soldier. <laughs> it, I only have to be at the colony, you don't. It's a colony action. It means I can steal from what you once per turn. Or Does one player once per turn. somebody need to be exiled before we can bash somebody on the head? <laughs> uh, no, technically. Does it make sense Maybe for me to Maybe we spend... kill the pirate. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, but I trust myself with your stuff more than I trust you. That's just how it is. So the I really remove... don't trust Doug with our stuff. <laughs> 
So any bite is auto dead, right? Yes, yes. and you become a zombie, and uh, I think it's uh, on our... Uh, James, if you've got fuel, you can burn it to travel. If we're yeah, abandoning it... any pretense of... Uh... But I uh, can't... I... Oh, so I, I can't uh, also, travel that Also, wait, 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 wait. Why are you moving? I'm not moving. Okay, sorry, I thought I... you rolled the exposure die. Right, can I finish no, my I turn? I my exposure die. <laughs> yes, you can finish your turn. Right, Sparky is going to search. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Cool. Uh, Sparky is going to search again. Okay. Ooh. Can I equip Sparky with the stuff? <laughs> yes. You can also magic teleport equipment between characters. They don't have to oh, that's the right, space. as long as I play it from my hand. Once it's equipped, yes. I can't. Correct. Well, in that case, my soldier now has a rifle. Okay, this is my rifle. This is my gun. Um, this and, is for fighting. This is for fun. Uh, I basically get to shoot a zombie anywhere uh, for free. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. It is. Um, uh... Oh, I can only take cards from your hand. So oh, I couldn't well, have tempted to steal case, your rifle. Uh, <laughs> Sparky, Sparky is getting a walkie-talkie, uh, which lets me uh, reduce the unused action die of another player by one and un increase uh, my action die by one. You know, I don't really need it, but I'm very tempted to screw with Doug's dice. <laughs> um, if you were to remove one of the threes, that would be very annoying. I can live with moving the four to a three. Because I'm basically well, going to spend them all on the farmer and get food and stock up. Yeah. Uh, tell you what, you agree to leave my uh, leave my cards alone. I agree to leave your dice alone. Um... Okay, you done? Uh, not yet. Hang on. Uh... So I can search again. Oh, well, I can start off by using the rifle. So let's go... Bang grocery store would be appreciated, but okay. Got... Put it in well, the I bag. Was... I was just going to do there because that's where my dog is. Ah, uh, okay. Well, are you sending two people to the grocery store? No. Well, then it's not a problem. No, I know it isn't, but... Just saying. I'll, I'll do it next turn. Uh, oh, Your dog also... avoids bites. My farmer is squishy. All the dice. We did not do? get a sample. Oh, that's true. You still get sni samples out of the sniper rifle. Yeah, I managed to shoot do... him three miles away. <laughs> now collect the samples. <laughs> um, Actually, it's double good in this scenario, so that's nice. So, and yeah. we need twelve samples. Oh God. Yep. Uh, and I have one more action. I think I'm just going to search the police station again, unless there's anything anybody wants me to do. Uh, you might want to contribute to the food supply, but that's not an action. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I should do that. Uh, there we go. There's uh, one food waste pile. And one tasty snacky. Uh, that covers spine. my soldier and somebody else, so I am pulling my weight. Piss off. Um, cool. And I will take another thing. Oh, look at that. My soldier now also has... Uh, Actually, no, want Sparky. This bag. I kind of don't want this bag. Oh, Sparky. Stuart, we didn't draw uh, uh, Crossroads. Oh, uh, yeah. Whoever is my person, which would be you, James, Doug. I think, isn't it? It's person, person to the, to the Oh, is it person to the left? I assume person to the right. I don't really okay, care. Okay, well, I'll do it. Person to the right. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Did it trigger? Uh, for those of you watching at home, Crossroads cards have specific uh, triggers on them, like you move character X or I don't think it triggered. you fight a zombie or something like that. You still have and... one action left, yeah? Uh, no, that's me. Okay, well, it didn't trigger. Uh, oh, uh, just so you're aware, Sparky now has a gun. You have given a dog a Colt 1911 pistol. Cool! Yes. That's a good he's, idea. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. <laughs> I kind of like the walkie-talkie thing as well. What's that, Sparky? <laughs> Jimmy fell down the well. Sparky you has made been him fall very... down the well at gunpoint. <laughs> Sparky has been very well trained to respond to commands. Just so happens those commands include shoot, kill, and hide the body. 
Okay, James's turn. That would be Stuart to pick up the crossroads. Yeah. I'm just going to delete them when they're done. Okay, what are you going to do, James? Okay, anything triggering? Not yet. Okay. Do I want Chat to wants go... to know if the dog has a holster. <laughs> no, no. Uh, maybe. Just uh, carries it in its mouth. I feel maybe it's strapped into like a holster on his harness pointing forwards and it's connected to his tail, the trigger. A utility belt. I mean, he appears to be wearing a cape. <laughs> or she we appears to be wearing a cape, I should say. Stuart said Sparky was a she. Yes. Hashtag dog feminism. <laughs> she, she is a good dog. <laughs> Woof. Bang. Okay. Do I want to go to another location? Um... I don't know. That's up to you. I'm just saying, if you come to the police station, the dog is armed. I mean, it doesn't really make a... Olivia make wants a huge... to be co-located with people, but Mike Cho should go somewhere and kill some zombies. Yeah. Um, okay. I would suggest so... not the library. I well, mean, I mean, it doesn't we... actually matter. What, what resources would you like? We need... Okay, so we need two food if I send Mike out to do something and your guys are staying in Colony, yeah? No, one of my guys is going to the grocery store. That's why I was asking if you wanted to stay... Uh, well, I was definitely going to send Mike out. Um, uh, I might send Mike to... You could send Olivia to the police station, get more weapons to kill more zombies, and heal the dog. Uh, so... I understand that, uh, you know, being a veterinarian <laughs> might be a little bit below your seven-year medical degree, but that might be an idea. Okay, uh, so... And burn fuel to travels completely safely. Yeah, I'm not going to burn fuel. I'm going to keep hanging on and hope that we... Yeah, it's a terrible game. Ooh! Well, hey, somebody's dead. So that's... Who's traveling? Mike. Yep, Mike's dead. Well, shit, already. We're all down to five. <laughs> wow. God damn it. <laughs> uh, just delete it. Oh, uh, I can't delete it. Doug, you'll have to... Yeah. Okay. So where, do I draw where were you going? Now? You were going where? I was going to the library. Okay, fine. Okay. Uh, do I draw another character now or do I wait? Nope, you don't draw another character till you get a card saying draw another character. Also, you lose a die. Shit. Okay. Um, what can I do in the colony with Olivia? <laughs> uh, you can clean the trash. <laughs> I would suggest, given that it's Olivia... And now we've lost one of our zombie killing dudes. Uh, can I build barricades? You can build you barricades, can. but they're all going to go away. We're going to lose them all. We're not going to. We'll only lose them all if we fail the crisis. Yeah. We're failing the crisis. We're not failing the crisis. I have three fuel. I was lying. <laughs> okay. Ah. Well, if you want to, if we added two more fuel, we get plus that you one more. I one of those fuel and didn't let Mike die. Just well, saying. Yes. <laughs> Hindsight is twenty twenty. <laughs> I said it. That's the fastest death I've ever seen in this game. Yes, I know. <laughs> in fairness, Stuart rolled a bite as well. He was just lucky that he had a dog. Uh, lucky or skilled? <laughs> Mike is a freaking poser. <laughs> okay, uh, so one fuel... No, face down. Oh, shit, sorry. In the crisis uh, contributions. Mike, Mike, Mike learned... Mike is a ninja because he watched a whole bunch of YouTube videos of Ultimate Ninja Warrior. That's what happened. <laughs> yeah, and, and wrapped a black t-shirt around his head and got some shurikens. <laughs> and he ran out and just went hiya in a zombie's face and was immediately... And the zombie ate it. <laughs> okay, so I'll use... Uh, I guess I'll use two uh, action dice to build two barricades, seeing as this bugger all else I can do with them. I would suggest leaving the colony and saving the dog, but okay, you do you. It's fine. I guess does he get new characters if he loses dog. all of them? I think he does, right? Uh, if a player's last remaining survivor would be killed... Uh, Where are you building the barricades, James? ...from the game, all cards in One their and hand, two. and draws a new survivor. Okay. Do so yes. Go? So you can what? put them wherever you want, but I would suggest one and two, because that's where the zombies will start spawning. Yeah. We'll get one zombie for every two uh, survivors in the colony, I think. Yeah, and then it's one for one in the world. Yeah. Take it from the bag, James. 
Okay. Right. Cool. Uh, your turn done? Uh, in fairness, I think you could probably do one more because I don't think your dice goes away until the start of next turn. So you do have three actions. So James has James has probably got some kind of barricade-based secret objective. I'm guessing so because really three fuel to allow you to put up three barricades, two of which are going to. Well, actually, no, none of them are going to get knocked down yet. But uh, yeah, do I want to go one and two again, or do I just want to? Uh, whatever, whatever you want. They will prevent a zombie from spawning at the cost of being destroyed. The reason that that's good is that you can barricade for a one on a dice roll, whereas when you fight a zombie, it has to be higher typically, and also you have to roll for exposure for fighting. Unless you are Thomas Hart, soldier extraordinaire. Or, or unless you just Mike fall Joe. over and die in the snow. Okay, <laughs> Thanks, so... Mike. I could try and recover our morale by going to the gas station instead. Oh, um, Greybeard the Pirate is going to steal from Stuart. He's going to steal this card. Fuck you. Okay, so we need more food. First thing. We do. So um, here's a food one. I'm okay with you contributing that, because that's my food. Counts as me contributing it. Although, in general, you don't want to contribute food ones because they add to the waste more than they really help us. Uh, Stuart, you should get rid of your crossroads, James Draw Crossroads. Oh, yeah. Oh, good point. Delete it. Uh, I can't. You'll have to. Okay. I think I should probably go to the grocery store, right? I mean, duh. <laughs> Yeah, it's just like, I'm not going to get any fuel. Okay, uh, Andrew Evans, the farmer, is going to the grocery store. He rolls for exposure. Hooray! He is fine. Uh, uh, okay, right. Uh, yeah, that, that one doesn't trigger. Okay, uh, I'm going to search. Uh, oh, it Where doesn't I... trigger at all. Well, then just put it down and Doug will delete it in a minute. Once per round, I can look at and keep one additional card. From the grocery store. Okay, so I'm going to play... I can... If they're in my hand, I can give them to someone else, right? Uh... Who has a character in the same location. Character in the same location, I think, yes, is the caveat. Okay, you, James and I both have a character of the colony. Here you go, James. Here you go. Oh, cool. Thank you. Can't play it until your turn. I know, but I'm being nice. You are. But, you know, you could have had it and had the extra dice straight away. Just saying. I'm being nice! Yeah. Okay. Or you're uh, playing, or you're deliberately attack playing. Attack a zombie. I think he's just enjoying the fact that we, <laughs> the ninja died immediately. Wound. <laughs> okay. Uh, do we get a sample? No. Okay. Attack another zombie. Sod it. We're going for it. This is our objective. That one is dead. Uh, roll for exposure. No wound. Dead zombie. And do we get a sample? No. God damn it! It's, it's Doug trying to get his survivors killed. <laughs> Doug is trying to get samples. That's what you have to do. I'm just saying, this, we, we're very well set up for me to start killing a lot of stuff. I got my guns. I'm all good. It's all good. And, uh... Okay. Forgive us for not putting all of our faith in the hands of a heavily armed dog. <laughs> but he... But he's such a good dog! Okay, I'm gonna play a medicine. I'm gonna get rid of that wound. Okay? Happy now? Woof. Uh... Is there anything else that I can do? I could add more food to the pile. Which we don't need at the moment. Yeah, I'm done. No crossroads? 
No crossroads. Okay, let me delete the card. Okay, it is now uh, the colony phase, so we have to pay food. Uh, we owe two food because it's half the number of colonists at the colony rounding up, which is two. Next, check waste. How many cards do we have in this pile? Three. One, two, three. At ten, we lose one morale. I was going to say it's really tedious if you don't just read the number and draw them all each time. I can't see the number. I don't know why it's not showing it. Okay, well, I can see the number. Fine. Uh, resolve uh, crisis. Yep. Okay, so this is James. If James is the traitor and has traitored, he's the worst traitor. Fuel. <laughs> fuel. Fuel. Okay. No jail for James. <laughs> if I have traitored, I'm uh, the worst traitor. You can delete traitor. that. In fairness, I'm not doing great on the not traitor side of things either. <laughs> Uh, adding zombies, one to the police station. Yep, one to the one to grocery, the grocery store. store. And one to the colony. Yeah, uh, two to the colony. Oh yes, it is, you're right. Because there are three people. There we go. Uh, same as food uh, for your chat. Um, half rounded up. Okay, uh, next. Check the main objective. We have not succeeded. We have not got any samples. Move the round tracker and pass the first player token. I have passed the first player token to James. You did that the last thing first. You fool. I did. I, it's, yes. Okay. Wow. James. Okay. Everybody has to roll the dice now. Uh, James only gets to roll two because he sucks. Ooh, okay. Six, a six and a one. I do not mind if you want to walkie talkie one of my... Oh, you can't. You're going I can't. Last. I'm going last. Yes. So okay, that fine. sucks. Oh, so it's my turn to go first this time. It yes. is. Yes. Okay, let's yeah. start with the obvious. Yeah. I will play my... Uh, where before you do anything... Oh, crossroads, sorry. Oh, crisis and crossroads. Our new crisis, food spoilage. Food equal to number of non-exiled players. Uh, if we fail until the end of the next round, non-exiled uh, players cannot use food tokens to increase their action dice, and we lose one morale. That seems like a perfectly reasonable thing to hold off on. Uh, we don't have... Uh, no, I don't want morale. To, I do not want to lose morale. We're going to be doing a lot of killing, which means a lot of survivors may die. But yeah. I know, but it's kind of weak as far as crises go, and I don't want to be. Okay, well I do, so I'm going to contribute to it, and I'm at the grocery store, so I'm going to get all the food. Uh, please note, it is number of food cards, not number of. Food. Yes. You so if you have three on it. Yeah, if I get a food three, it's going into the food supply. It's not going there. Yeah, I'm just saying that's that's what it's. I know. Yeah, I got um, you. I got I you, fam. No I got food. you. I'm not. I can. I guess I don't really want to come to the grocery store. I could go to the hospital. There's quite a bit of food there. Where are there other weapons? Uh, gas station is the only other place for because weapons. America, you can get weapons at the gas station. Of course you can. Why wouldn't I you? Lots of truck states. Uh, lots of truck cabs. <laughs> okay. Be more worrying if you could get them in the library. I mean, this is why the school's been overrun with zombies, because there are no fully automatic weapons there. Right, Stuart, can, can you draw a crossroads card for me, please? And then you also are going to draw a character card, right? Uh, and then, yeah, as soon as that's done, I'm going to draw a character card. Carry on. Uh, playing my one outsider. The There's GJ's your character card over here. Uh, where this, is it? This pile here. Who is your new person? You can put it out. We can see. My new person is Sophie Robertson, the pilot. Oh, she's also once... known as Sophie Robinson. Oh, I guess. Okay, fair enough. Once it's per round, you may look at the top card of a single location's item deck. After you've looked at the card, place it back on top of that item deck. That's pretty nice. Mm. Well, it's a bit... <laughs> I mean, I can't really do much with it. Well, well you, you can, can look before you go steer. somewhere. If we're really urgent on an item. If you've nothing else to use it for, I would have a look at the gas station because I'm considering sending the pirate there. Uh, okay, I will use it on the gas station. I would like a weapon. If you could tell me that it's a weapon, that would be great. Is it a weapon? It is not a weapon. Okay, I might go to the police station instead. <laughs> I'm coming to save you, Sparky. 
time. <laughs> okay. I have no fuel. Um, I don't know exactly what I should be doing now either. Cause <laughs> so... uh, where's where's Sophie the pilot? Uh, colony. Thing. So uh, she's down a... here. Boop. Yep. There we go. Okay. So next um, to James, so that we can see. I could go search. I could go search somewhere with Sophie, just because she's got great search. Um, I, I'm kind of crap at combat with both of my characters right now. Uh -huh. um, okay. Uh, Could you stop flipping everything over, Stuart? I, I'm thinking of going to the Stuart, library. Leave it alone. I'm thinking of going to the library. Okay, sure. With, with uh, Sophie, so I'd have... Okay, I have to roll an exposure dice. And please don't die again. This would Stop. be embarrassing. Stop! What? The snow falls heavily as the world turns white. And visibility oh, no. drops to only a few yards around you. Of course a blizzard would come now. You're not alone, though. Another shape moves through the storm, gesticulating wildly as it struggles through the snow. And then another. And still another. Your stomach lurches as you realize you've walked into the middle of a roving horde of the dead. Weighing your options, you may. You suspect the reduced visibility may help you pass with minimum detection. But you also have to admit, the odds are not in your favor. Option one. You push on, doing your best to avoid them. Option two. Your goal is important, but so is not becoming one of them. Well, thank you. That's informative. Um, I'm not telling you the consequences because it's more fun if you don't know the consequences before you make a decision. Hell yeah. <laughs> Screw it. I don't but... know you that well, Sophie. Let's go. <laughs> Roll for exposure on that survivor three additional times. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, great. Why? Okay. Okay. One. Nothing. Two. Nothing. Oh, come on, James. Come back in the century. Wound. Wound. Nothing. Hooray. Okay. How come the lady who flies planes can fight better than the ninja? <laughs> Because Dodge, the ninja wasn't a real like ninja. <laughs> the ninja was just a dude with a black t-shirt wrapped around his head. Which probably wouldn't have helped him as far as camouflage in a blizzard goes. <laughs> right, okay, so Sophie is at the library. Yes. Now, uh, okay, I've got two action dice and I'm going to search. Okay, uh, you need to kill a zombie if you're there. I need to kill uh, a zombie? Yes. I can take care of it. You must kill a zombie. I can I can take care of it. It's fine. You must kill a zombie or trust Stuart. Uh, I have the rifle. I will quite happily shoot a zombie there. You must kill a zombie or trust Stuart. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll kill a zombie. <laughs> roll for exposure. I try to help. <laughs> That's my fifth exposure roll this turn. Stop okay, you, you two on are both screen. are just trying to get yourselves killed. Yes! <laughs> You're fine. I am fine. Hey, so... We're just trying not to, to make ourselves beholden to you. Uh, roll for samples. Yeah, I get to roll for samples. No. No samples. <laughs> Somebody get a sample! How many zombies have we killed? Like five now? Hey, uh, uh, severely hate us. I am okay. going to change the color of the sample die. I think it should be... Okay, so we have a dead zombie, I'm and use I will the search. Ones. Green. So this is the also, samples die. Also, uh, James, you get a ne an extra die for next turn. Oh. Because you've now got two characters. Because uh, I'm yes. nice. You can change it to make it purple by right-clicking and going... Colored. Okay, is that your turn done? Uh,
I... Mm, I could... I'm debating playing a card now. Uh... Are you contributing to the food crisis? Is anybody else going out of the colony this turn? Yes. Okay, uh, in that case, it makes I think it makes sense for me to do this then. I'm going to... I have a I have a two outsiders card. Okay. Uh, which gives me uh, an extra uh, an extra survivor in my following. Plus two uh, helpless but, survivors. Plus one helpless survivor. Okay. But that means it's four at the colony once somebody leaves. So. Okay, that's fine. I mean, it's kind of annoying, but okay. Uh, I, grab I, yourself a helpless survivor. I uh, somewhat wish I hadn't given you that survivor because now you are more powered up. And if you are the traitor, I have done a terrible thing. <laughs> oh, guess what? I have the construction worker, so I can build more barricades. <laughs> okay, Ashley Ross, the construction worker. Why do all your female characters have scars oh, on oh, their face? Oh, you can use that. Use Look, that. does Olivia have a scar? No, she just has a... No, oh, that yeah, above her eyebrow is a scar. All of I your can... female characters have scars on their face, James. Do we have to have a conversation? <laughs> oh, God's sake. It is, that's, you know, that's the apocalypse. Super, you did be the thing. You basically just accused him of... Okay. Um, We're literally surrounded by zombies and you're immediately... James, 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 James you before you declare your I didn't go yes, anywhere. I, I, heard I just I heard asked. It. Yes, I can now use uh, my new survivor's ability to build an extra barricade for the freeze. Uh, yep. I would maybe stick it in the library. You also get an extra dice next turn. I will indeed stick it in the library, so I don't have to worry about killing zombies there quite so much. I don't appear to be able to change that die. Uh, oh, that's a good chat, actually. Can you only do it where she is? Do you reckon? Uh, it says? says anywhere, but that just means... It says, it says perform, you a perform a barricade action. action. That requires you to be in that place. Have you found okay. her uh, token? In that case, uh, I will... It's a woman to... with a scar on her face. Yeah, that's her. Got her. Yeah, in the uh, up next to James's doctor, just so we keep peoples together. Stop trying to pair her up with the pirate. The pirate is not interested. The pirate is asexual. He loves only the sea. <laughs> <laughs> okay, is it my turn? James, I need you to crossroads. Uh, yes, it is your turn. I will go crossroads. And I can't change the color of that die for some reason. So Stuart, if you could do it. Uh, oh, yeah, sure. The part, the grey one, because James is going to yeah, have yeah. all of them next time. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to steal from... Oh, piss off. James, because I stole from Stuart last night. Is that a, is James, what's this card here? It's It shows as black to me. Uh, this card here is the, the Crossroads card. Okay, right, so I'll not steal it then. Okay, this is good. This is good. We've taken agency away from James. Uh, I'm going to go with the pirate to the gas station, I think, and try and get weapons. I know that the top card isn't a weapon, but I'm going to kill some zombies too. So roll for exposure. Quick question. Um, all the um, survivors no that are up here, they're all the ones in the deck, yes? It's not yeah. one of those optional things, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, kill a zomble at the gas station. Oh, Ooh, frostbite. Bad. Okay, well, that sucks. I used so, my medicine last turn. Chat, for, for, for your information, frostbite is like a wound, except it keeps wounding you at the start of each turn. Okay. Uh, but you did kill a zombie, so... Yay, I got a sample! Put it on the... There, yeah. So, we have one. We need 12. Uh, okay. uh, my... Can I just stop you before you do any more killing and searching? You're meant to be providing food. I will provide food in a there? second, okay? Yeah, uh, no, I just killed there. Yeah, I was thinking. <laughs> you, you do at least one search with your farmer. I'm going to search character. with the farmer, okay? I'm going to okay, do that now. Just... Chill. Okay, so you're searching with the farmer. Yes. Very infested in your blooming Okay, I pirate. have something to say. Okay, before I do the search. 
Uh, well, it says if you perform a search. Okay, well, tell me what's going on. You cry out in terror as the zombie bear lumbers towards you. Oh, great. Cool. Zombie bears. That's what we need right now. Its intestines dragging through the gravel behind it. Cornered in an alley. You when you say its intestines, do you mean the intestines it's acquired from someone else to eat or the ones that should be inside it? It, the sentence is ambiguous. <laughs> Cornered in an alley, you press against the dumpster and prepare to meet death. But then a bold cry echoes from on high, and lo, a mighty outdoorsman leaps from a nearby tree. What? <laughs> and lands upon the bear's back. What? <laughs> is, this, is this Putin? Is he coming down to ride a bear for a PR stunt in the middle of the zombie apocalypse? The beast. I love how James is trying to get through this. <laughs> James, are you what there? What did the beast do, James? Uh oh. Oh, he's dropped. Has he? But, uh, can you hear me? Yes. Yep. Yes. The beast heaves and lets. Out... Oh no. The beast heaves and lets out a sickly growl before the newcomer holds tight before applying a ferocious chokehold. <laughs> <laughs> it's Zangief. <laughs> <laughs> Choke Minute... that bear! <laughs> it's choking later. the bear a euphemism. If your nickname for it is the bear, I don't know if you're boasting or commenting on... It's hairiness. <laughs> it gets better. Minutes later, the bear lies decapitated on the ground. <laughs> that is not a chokehold. This, this is a very inappropriate joke to make about American policing. Here, I was we're not going to make it, please. Yes. I know. <laughs> the, the bear Jesus lies Christ. <laughs> the bear lies decapitated on the ground and your rugged saviour <laughs> gives you a hand up before offering to teach you how to suckle at nature's generous bosom. <laughs> okay, you... you the farmer no. is totally getting off with this guy, whoever it is. You have <laughs> or sucking the bear's tits. It's you one or the other. <laughs> Come on, James. <laughs> you can make it through this. Here are your two options. <laughs> to suckle or not to suckle. <laughs> it gets worse. It's Last Jedi. That's what it is. Quote... Man, I appreciate the save, but I'm not suckling at anything. <laughs> the handsome man looks dejected and slouches away. <laughs> or option two. You run naked through the woods with your new friend. <laughs> Free, perhaps, for the first time in your life. <laughs> Does genuinely say that? <laughs> yes, you run. I, I'm literally reading it off the card. Uh, I, I think we have to run naked through the woods. Okay, you need to roll once for exposure. <laughs> okay. Do I still get to do my search after all of this? <laughs> yes. Okay. It's a lot. And now you get to search the survivor deck for Kodiak Colby <laughs> and add him to your following. <laughs> Stuart, can you find him on the uh, people's? Er Uh, can I do this just from the way they look? Uh, yes, yes, I can. Um, <laughs> there he is. <laughs> Here he is, Kodiak Colby, the woodsman. Anywhere, Kodiak does not count towards the total number of survivors when determining how much food the colony needs or when placing zombies. Forming a search with Cody, like you cannot use noise tokens. So plus, two plus two plus for all actions. That's fucking sweet, dude. Uh, I put him up in the grocery store. I assume he starts up there, wherever. It doesn't. I don't. Uh, I don't think. And they says, always start um, in the colony, don't they? It just says uh, add him to your following, so it doesn't say to start where you start. I'm mm. pretty sure it's always at the colony. Yeah, it makes. Yeah, I think that's correct. Okay, fair enough. But it's okay. But he wants to be with Andrew. They run naked together. Okay, I'm gonna get my cards from my search. Jesus Christ! 
Please don't give me any more really weird <laughs> and confusing okay, tasks. Okay, so <laughs> here's what like I'm gonna the, do. I still want to know how he crisis contribution. With bare hands. <laughs> crisis contribution. Crisis contribution. We are set on the crisis. If you want to put two more in, then uh, that would be a good thing. So if we fail, it's entirely on you, Duck. Yes, it is. Uh, I'm going to play a two food two, which means we have enough food for this turn. Uh, I still have one more action to take. God, it's been a turn. Uh, fuck, I really... Okay, I'm going to search the grocery store again. That's my best shop for medicine, right? Oh, James, if I wanted medicine, would I search at the gas station? Uh, uh, no. no, you would not. Okay, well, let me search what? at the grocery store. Oh, yeah, that's fair. He has looked at the top one already. Yes. Because yeah, you had to do a search at all at the gas station. Medicine. Frostbite goes away. Okay, uh, I don't have any free actions. So I believe that I'm done. Why is that there? Why is what where? No! No! Rawr. Get rid of the bear, please. Uh, Stuart, it is your turn. Let me quickly get rid of your mess. Okay, my turn. Here we go. Excitement. Uh, I draw a crossroads card for you. Okay. Uh, uh, you have a player at the colony, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, your guy at the colony says, I'm bored. Come on, let's roll some dice. Surely everyone here has got something they can ante up. I got a pair of clean socks that says I wipe the floor with you chumps. Each player with one or more survivors at the colony must vote with a thumbs up or thumbs down. The option with the most votes takes effect. Uh, thumbs up option. One at a time, starting with the first player... Uh, each player may place one item card from the hand into the centre of the play area for each survivor they control at the colony. Uh, for every card played, that player rolls one die. The player that rolled the highest die takes all the cards placed in the centre of the play area and adds them to their hand re-roll ties. Thumbs down, nothing happens. Right, so, okay. I don't know how we indicate thumbs, thumbs up or thumbs down, given that we're uh, not doing face cam. Uh, tell you what, take a, take a, no. Let's not make it a What happens objective. if I don't have enough items to play one for both of my characters at the colony? Uh, it says you may. So you don't roll any dice in that case. So you probably won't win. I'm kind of not interested in doing this. It's yeah, lame. it seems kind of boring and extra. That's okay, just... bye. Not doing. Thumbs down. Thumbs down. So an impromptu dice game versus a zombie bear being decapitated by a mysterious roving lumberjack with his bare hands, followed okay. by a nudist romp in the snow. Uh, you know what? Sparky is just going to keep searching for them sweet, sweet weapons. So That's uh, a good plan. Yeah, let's just... What do I need to search? Two. So it would be generous of you to distribute it. those weapons around so other people can kill, because you've got some good shit going on. Okay. Just saying. Uh, let's do. Um, oh, uh, also, there's two zombies here. So on a five plus, I can kill two zombies. So let's do that. Okay. Uh, with bang, what? bang. Uh, soldier. Colony five plus once per round, kill two zo zombies and don't roll for exposure. Nice. This is why Soldier is living here. Uh, soldier that was is a living barricade. That was a barricade, not a zombie. See, this is why, James, we wanted zombies at the colony. Uh, okay, let's give it a wee roll. Yay! One, two. There okay, you go. so we are now at three. Uh, have what location used... is bad? Have you anybody used needing your... help? You know what? No, you rejected my help. So none of you are in immediate danger. Fuck all of you. Yeah, Rifle, help your doggy. Boom, shoot the dog. Help for the doggy. <laughs> no, you said shoot the dog. <laughs> no samples. No samples. Wait, you killed like four, uh, five, three zombies there. How many did, dives did you roll? Uh, I got two successful, one failed. Oh, okay, so we have two samples. Joy. We've got three samples. Where are the tokens for that? On the, They're uh, on the thing. objective card. Ah, okay, gotcha. Uh, and I'm going to search the police station again. For evidence of their misdeeds. Uh, the dog now also has a rifle. <laughs> 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 
Why? Why is the <laughs> dog? Why is the dog know, the dual great wielding? Thing about this, the great thing about this, your argument that I should give this away, there's zero reason to give it away on the basis that I can pick a zombie at any location, so I can help you out as long as you're not assholes about it. Well, the I reason really to give it away is to build trust with people who are not you. Well, you know what? You're a traitor. I'm quite happy to shoot zombies for you, but given that the fact that you show no trust for me, I'm not particularly inclined to give my guns away. Can you use both weapons also, at once? Uh, yes, I think so. I don't think there's anything about equipment. Let me check this. Uh, I can't find the thing on equipment. Hold on. Ah, okay. Instead, a player may equip any... Once a card is equipped, it cannot be unequipped unless it's being added to a crisis or being handed off. Uh, nope, it, there is no limit to it. It just says you get that ability. So your dog is a sniper. My dog is a sniping... Uh, sniper shooting. wolf! <laughs> a sniper with a sidearm as well, just in case, you know. Yeah, got that back up. Nobody left uh, my sniper I am wolf now, joke. Uh, I'm slightly tempted to move to the hospital because we're pretty well tooled up on weapons and I'm feeling like medicine might be a thing we do need. And there's more food there. I don't know why you wouldn't just keep killing where you are. But medicine and food... And fuel, those are all good. I wouldn't move your soldier, if that's what you're suggesting. No, I'm not moving the soldier. I'm thinking moving Sparky. Not this turn, maybe. Yeah, I'll do it beginning of next turn if I'm going to do it. Okay. Okay. Cool. Uh, yeah, because yeah. if... Oh, well, Sparky wouldn't die anyway because of the bite thing, so it's fine. Uh, this is really annoying because I don't want you to take this off me. That's my pirate I, is not in the... Oh, my pirate. Yet. Yeah, no, my pirate left the, uh, the colony, Stuart. I can't take it. Oh, hey! Hurrah! I thought you'd appreciate that. I do. It's I do. a symbol of my trust. That's very nice. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, um, did we put... Oh, we did. Okay, so we have four here now. Uh, five. No, We've because my bootsman doesn't count. Oh, yeah. Okay, no, that's fine. Either for food Ooh. or for zombies. I'm assuming he's still eating the remains of the zombie bear. He, he's staying at the colony, but in truth, he sleeps outside in a tree. I mean, he basically is neutral. He gets me one extra dice, but other than that, he doesn't really do anything. That's also... okay, because he's neutral, so he has no cost to have. I can't uh, change the color of the dice for whatever reason. That is okay. I will Can you do you. that for me? He's also got solid combat and... Um... Oh yeah, but there's no reason for him to ever leave the colony. Not unless you desperately need to search somewhere. The search is pretty good. Oh yeah. It's just generically good character. Yeah. Uh, what's next? Stuart, are you done? Uh, yes I am. Uh, okay, I in that case... I've done all my abilities, yes. Uh, yes do you want to... Oh, uh, hang on, I've got the rifle. Uh, I got the new rifle. Oh yeah, uh... you should shoot a zombie. Uh, Gas station. Help a brother really out. Hate that pirate. Let's let's help James out. Uh, roll for samples. Yep. Oops. Hey, I've gotten two samples. That's more than anybody else. You have. I've got one, James. I'm Moving useful. on. <laughs> exile him. Exile him now. First person to suggest exiling someone's always the traitor. Okay, so that is, well, that would be it for that round. End turn, yes. Uh, okay, didn't so. you suggest exiling him at the beginning when you said it was like James? That was before we dealt anything. <laughs> <laughs> Just said. Uh, okay, so we need to pay food, which is going to be two food. We need to check the waste, which is fine. We need to uh, resolve the crisis. Food. Food! Food! I know you knew, but it's probably good practice to shuffle in the future. I and mean, delete. There was the only person who actually put them in. Okay, so we succeeded this crisis. Hooray! Hey. Uh, next thing we have to do, add zombies! So we had two zombies to home. Uh, 
and you're doing the uh, remote locations. I am, yes. Check uh, the main objective. We have not succeeded. We are at 3 of 12. Move the round tracker token. We have four rounds to go. We need to get to killing. Uh, I'm pulling my weight on killing. I know. I wasn't really talking to you there. Pass the first <laughs> player token. I'm sorry. My murder man immediately committed suicide by walking into the snow. <laughs> I mean, you make a good point. Your murder man. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Worst everybody, ever. roll your dice and let's get a crisis card. The crisis is Legions of Death. Fuel equal to the number of non-exile players. Fail, add 12 zombies to the colony. I think we're okay adding zombies to the colony. Also, I have no fuel. Um, well, this is a steaming pile of shit. Mine is also a steaming pile of shit. Oops. Uh, that needs to be... What can off. I say, dude? You wanted zombies. <laughs> what? No. I mean, my dice roll. Everything else is fine. Well, okay. Dice roll isn't uh, crossroads. James draw crossroads. And then let's get on with this. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to... Uh, wait a second. Uh, okay. Okay, so uh, we have an option for if there is at least one helpless survival at the colony. Yep. Shoot uh, them! Shoot them in the face! Let me introduce you to Lucky Luke Smith, uh, <laughs> who says, I'm not helpless, I'll stay close, I promise. Uh, we remove one helpless survivor from the game, uh, we attach this guard to a survivor that you control, and it gains the following ability. Uh, I, I'm assuming that this is applies to you, not me, Doug. Yes. Uh, I don't think Doug gets to know what the abilities are, does he? Yeah, if it's not a choice, yes, I do. Oh, okay, fair it's, enough. It's, it's, it's the only option. Uh, oh, so we sorry, it's a, a, a media option, fair enough. Yeah. Uh, attach this card to a survivor you control. It gains the following ability. Uh, Non-colony, at the beginning of your turn, roll a die. On a result of five or higher, draw a card from any item deck. Ooh. Okay, I am going to put that on Andrew put that Evans. On. Make sure whoever is gets that is going to survive. <laughs> Andrew Evans, because he's. I'm assuming if they the die, corner. if they die, uh, they both die. Does it say? Uh, James? Well, it's basically attached to that card. I'm assuming that it, it doesn't say anything about being reattached, so I'm assuming it's basically equipment now in the form okay. of a small child. So the farmer frolicked in the woods naked with the woodsman and now has a child. Gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> um, this all makes perfect sense. So the first thing I'm going to do is search with the farmer. Okay. Should just get these out, shouldn't I? Food three. Also, I'm going to play another food three. So we should be completely set for food for a long time. Uh, what else do I want to do? So, at the beginning of my turn, do I get to use this this turn? Use what? Your thing? Yeah, abilities. The Lucky are... Luke Smith. So yeah. uh, no, it's at the beginning of your turn, uh, your your turn had already begun, I think. Yeah, I think it had. Oh, yeah, it does say that. So, I'm only going to get three goes at it, but that's fine. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. I think I want to search with Greybeard. I'm not doing any of the fuel, by the way, just so you know. And now I have two ones. Now, Greybeard can kill on a one plus, so I'm going to kill a Zomble. And get a Frostbite, because of course I am. 
play a medicine. Uh, Stuart, how many's in that pile now? Eight. Okay. Then I'm gonna have the. Do you have to roll exposure to take out the trash? No. Okay, uh, my woodsman's gonna take out the trash. One, two, three. Oh, and uh, for sample. I got a sample! Stuart and I are now equal on samples. That is my turn. It is done. Stuart, I draw a crossroad for you. Uh, okay. You you have a survivor outside the colony, don't you? Yes. Oh no, you have a survivor at the colony, rather. Uh, yes, both. Okay. I need everybody at the gate right now. There's a flatbed that just pulled up, loaded with refugees. Each player with one or more survivors of the colony must vote with a thumbs up or thumbs down. The option with the most votes takes effect. Thumbs up. We don't have much, but if your people are willing to pull their own weight, we can give you a home. For the winter, at least. After that, you're on your own. Each player draw one survivor from the survivor deck and adds it to the following. Each player also adds one helpless survivor to the colony. Or we can't take any more. I'm sorry, we just can't take on any more. You're going to have to keep moving. Their faces suggest they've heard those words too many times before. They look downwards in acceptance, and as soon as the truck is driving away... Uh, three days later, you find the truck collapsed on the side of the road. The people are gone, but blood is caked on the road. Nothing else happens. Uh, okay, well... So wait, what's the options there? Um, we get a bunch of people, or we don't. And so one survivor get... each, one helpless survivor each. Uh, uh, what's the best way to do... Um... So, top of the screen for thumbs up, bottom of the screen for thumbs down. Start in the middle. Who put loads of food in the store? Me. Was that legit? Yeah. How much? Where did that? I got two from? food three cards. It's in the grocery. Oh, nice. I'm keeping you well stocked, okay? Okay, so are you ready to vote? Put your hand in the middle, James. To the top of the screen, to the top of the table for a thumbs up, bottom up of the table here. for a thumbs down. Yes, down here. No. Got it? Yep. One, two, three, go. Okay, so everybody gets a survivor. Did we shuffle these after we went through them? Yes. No, just one, not the whole deck. And three helpless survivors. Ooh, I have an accountant. Okay. Stuart has David Garcia, the accountant. Uh, when performing a search with David, you may look at one additional card. So look at, but That's not keep. That's pretty good. Yeah, no, it's still pretty good. It is. I have Daniel Smith, the sheriff. Man, I'm building the manliest team. <laughs> uh, James's team's all going to fall for me. Uh, anywhere on a 4+, plus, I may kill two zombies at Daniel's current location, only roll for exposure once. That is, and it's a 2+, plus to kill. That is pretty good for this scenario. James, who did I, you get? I am building a team that can, can't really be described as manly. Uh, I am... There we go. <laughs> Oh, Felicia Day! Felicia Day! <laughs> it, oh, awesome. it fucking literally is Felicia Day as well. <laughs> yeah, it literally is Felicia Day! <laughs> <laughs> I forgot she was in this. Okay, for the purposes of triggering resolving crossroad cards, in addition to her own name, Felicia is considered to have the name of every survivor not currently in play, because she's an actress. <laughs> okay. So it's basically she's going to trigger lots and lots of crossroads events, but she does have very good skills as far as fighting and searching goes. Do I get a dice for her now? Yeah. No. Uh, yes, immediately as she comes in, but you don't get to roll it. Oh, yeah. Okay, but it's considered a used die. Oh, so I don't get so to it roll it. Yeah, it doesn't count towards your dice, basically. So, okay. so what we're establishing with James over here is that James is, like, literally just Whedon. His team is full <laughs> of... Uh, Badass, badass archetypal lady. female woman, and they'll have they'll have one personality trait, which is badass. <laughs> uh, there's also going to be an issue with uh, one of them is going to end up in a wonderful relationship, and something horrible will happen to their partner. Oh yes, Maybe that's that the. I'm just looking at them. I don't think because because he has two personality types that he ever writes, and they are badass and dits. <laughs> <laughs> 
But, you know, we've got a doctor, a pilot, a construction worker, and an actress. And they all seem to be very badass. I mean, the closest would be Felicia Day. Except she's got a fucking sword and there's a decapitated zombie head there. Look at her stats! Christ! Okay. Is that my sheriff? That's my sheriff. I got your sheriff for you. Right. Um... Also... That is a tiny, tiny bit harsh on Joss Whedon. Uh, it's not harsh on Joss Whedon at all. I... Joss Whedon cannot write characters. Joss Whedon, ma Whedon makes very good films where the characters have been defined by other people for him. Uh, Buffy was pretty good. He writes good dialogue, but it, unrealistic in the sense of it's always what you wish, wish you would said. said after the fact, right? Yeah, but that's somewhat the point of fantasy stuff isn't it right but that's that's what i mean it's like wish fulfillment and especially with the women that like i'm not complaining because it's an awful lot better than what came before him but he has a type that he's he cl very type, clearly yeah, it into would be, it would be nice if he involved a little bit but on the other hand he created buffy the powerhouse of like just sure I, I just feel like buffy would have like in my mind i understand how buffy moved the whole industry forward in terms of like lead female characters and and Bech del test and all the rest of it it would just be really nice if i believed that that was the intention by means of him having written any other female character any differently ever <laughs> <laughs> right as opposed to that's what he's into <laughs> am i wrong <laughs> uh, yeah yeah Don't get me wrong, there's much worse in entertainment than that. But I find it irritating. I mean, he can write badass, not super-powered women, too. <laughs> yes, but what is their personality? Uh... It's always badass or dits. There is no middle ground. Uh, Willow wasn't really a dits, and also wasn't super badass in conventional sense. I, th I think you're stretching here. Anyway... <laughs> Let's move on from the argument about Joss Whedon and have an argument about surviving the cold, dead winter. Stuart, you get an extra die in your used die pile. We have so many people now. We started off immediately, like, the first thing that happens is the ninja dies, and now suddenly we have a fucking army. <laughs> it's good. It's good. <laughs> That's what we want. Uh, okay. Led by Felicia Day for some reason. <laughs> um, I think we all know who our real leader is. We all follow Sparky. Uh, why have you only... Oh, that's your first You're... new character, isn't it? Huh. It is my first new character. <laughs> and your character that isn't armed. <laughs> is armless. Armless. Hey, hey, hey. James, I'd like hey. to start a vote to exile. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, right. First thing I'm going to do is... Uh, James... Uh, what dice oh. would you most like to lose a point off of? What? <laughs> Pick one of your dice and reduce it by one, please. Oh, um... So that his dog can use the walkie-talkie. I don't actually need the six for anything, so take that one. I do over. it. I, I don't care. I wasn't really giving you a choice. You have clearly got more than enough uh, high-powered uh, high powered dice there. Yeah. Um, Scroll to change it, I think. Uh, right click ro set rotational value. Okay, that too. Okay. okay. Uh, do I want more guns? Uh, <laughs> this is how you can tell Stuart isn't an American. <laughs> <laughs> that was a question. Do I want more guns for my dog? That's more than <laughs> in that direction. Uh, Sparky is going to go to the hospital. Roll for exposure. Just did. Frostbite! Ooh, ah, that's no good. Medicine! Bye bye, Frostbite. <laughs> Hello, trash. It's fine, it's at six. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, because someone's taking care of it, just saying. Well, it still would have been fine. It would have been at nine, so bite me. Uh, okay, let's. No, that's the zombie's do... job. Searchy. Sparky, fetch! <laughs> Searchy. 
I need to get my pirate bike to base. Uh, Steal all the things from the dog. <laughs> yeah, you know what? I'm going to play this now so that I get Oh, the are you dice. serious? <laughs> you guys have more than me. Um, How have we ended up with... Oh, it's uh, only one helpless survivor, I suppose. Yeah, it's fine. Hey, I've got the fireman. I've got my original crew back. Okay, Gabriel Diaz. Uh, once per round, when Gabriel is, is at a location with an item deck, you may reveal the top four cards of that item deck. If you reveal any outsider card, you may place one into your hand, shuffle the remaining cards back to item deck. Oh, cool. He lets us get more mouths to feed. <laughs> Fucking wonderful. Uh, where is he? he is... We're about to get a there. lot of zombies at the colony. Yeah, this is this is all part of the plan. So I hope your soldier's taking out those two. Yes, of course. And getting he is. samples. Uh oh. Okay, so uh, we have two. Four, no, six. no, no, no. He's not because he can't because it's two plus. Uh, sorry, it's five plus to do the colony ability. Um. Have you got a junk? Oh shit! Uh, yeah, that only lets me re-roll. I could spend a food token to increase it by one. Uh, you can spend one food token. That would be okay. Uh, I'll tell you what, uh, James, deal with the trash. There we go. There's another two food. I will spend one. Okay, and we'll put one. Put one there. Put that back. Put that back. Put that back. It was two food. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. Um, so that increases by one, and I will use that to kill two zombies. Roll for samples twice. Nope. 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 Oh, damn it. Snickers. Uh, okay, where else would we like clear? Why are we so bad at rolling for samples? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Let's also send Gabriel. You have two Taylor. snipes to make, right? I do. Uh, Gabriel, you head to the police station. There we go. Okay. Uh, Roll for exposure. Off the table, why not? Oh, it's fine. <laughs> Apparently. Uh, okay. okay. We'll take a blank. That's fine. Sounds like um, bullshit, but okay. Fine, I'll re-roll it. I, actually, I said we'll take a blank. This is going to be bad now. Okay, it's a it's wound. It's a wound. There you go. <sighs> Didn't really want that, but okay. Well, I don't want anyone questioning my um, commitment to the game. Um... No, yeah, we've seen. Is... Your commitment to building jails is uh, second to none. <laughs> uh, also, let's... Uh, yeah, let's do some snipage. Hmm. Who shall we do some snipage for? I mean, it'd uh, be nice to help out the uh, farmer. It would. I'm just thinking who's in most danger. James, are you planning on going anywhere that you yeah, would I'm need gonna be sending uh, somewhere I'm clear? Be sending some... Well, I'm, I'm definitely going to be sending uh, Felicia Day out. Um, the only question... Where to? If you get Felicia Day killed, the internet is going to come for you. Currently, um, all the external locations are safe. Where I, where would you like to go? Actually, Ross is also great at combat, but I might want to... It's a case of whether you want me to leave her in the colony and just build barricades and take Barricades out don't help us that much, because barricades mean we don't get zombies. Yeah, but, we're yeah, but he wants 12. to build barricades for his secret objective. Uh, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> very, very obviously, yes. The other thing is, my doctor uh, can only heal people with wounds, and there are no people with wounds here. <laughs> uh, there is a there is a, a fireman and a dog who would both appreciate your help. <laughs> okay. Uh, tell you what, I'll clear I'll, I'll clear one off the police station. Grocery store, maybe. Uh, and you guys can choose the other one. So, dog well, wants grocery send, store. I mean, uh, at the base at the moment. Where do you want to go, sorry? Not the gas station. You don't want one cleared off the gas no, station? No, I'll leave, let the pirate kill. Alright, there we go. Nope, no samples. Please! <laughs> uh, where's the other one dying? Uh, it died off the grocery store. Yeah, it's already gone. Okay. But no Ooh, samples. Though. Should I send the accountant out? He does get to look at an extra card. He probably should, but maybe if you haven't got any actions, not this turn, unless there's. I don't have any actions. Uh, does it save I us do... a food? 
It it doesn't yet. It does if James sends somebody out. James, are does... you sending someone out? Yes. Okay, well, that'll save us a food then. Also, we're going to have to add 12 zombies. Presumably, we're also going to have to add 5 for this. That becomes a lot, a lot of zombies. Whereas if I send him out, that will reduce that by one if James sends somebody out. Mm -hmm. So I will send him to the police station because that's still safe. Or grocery store. I'll send him to the grocery okay. store. Roll exposure. Do not roll a bite or I will be very upset with you. Frostbite! It's all fine. Which one? This uh, was this uh, guy. The accountant. Yeah. Uh... If the doctor can take care of a zombie, um, be lovely to see her at the grocery store. <laughs> okay. Could have uh, a fuel for that move. Is that the end of your turn, Stuart? That is now the end of my turn. It could be worse. If it was a bite and you killed my uh, farmer as well, we would be fucked on food. Okay, draw crossroads. And remember the Felicia Stuart. Day thing means that there's a good chance it's going to activate. <laughs> Okay. You you good? Mhm. Mm okay. I will trust that you are paying attention to the Felicia Day. <laughs> I am paying and... fucking attention. Of course, you're paying attention to Felicia Day. Come on, please. Eh. Okay. Right. So I'm just trying to think. I can move my doctor out and heal people. Or I can leave my doctor in to heal when with the inevitable combat, which is going to be coming at the colony. Uh, but we'd like you to move one out because it saves us a food and a zombie. Oh yeah, I'm definitely moving Felicia Day out. It's a but the the three the other two I have left are my barricade expert, who's good at combat, uh, and also my doctor. So the other thing you could do is you could go to the grocery store and heal the accountant, but you would have to kill a zombie there, otherwise we'll overrun. So I'm not mm. recommending it. It would be better if we just waited for the next turn around and hopefully either Stuart or I will draw medicine, although he will get that extra wound immediately. We get yeah. one. Uh, we get an extra zombie in each location for uh, every extra person. You have there. no medicine on you, right? Oh. Um. No. We get an extra zombie in a location for every person who's there, right? Yes. Uh, plus a 50-50 chance per rummage token if we choose to rummage, which we're clear we haven't done because they're all so zombied up. Okay, right. I'm gonna... I'm thinking maybe I move uh, Felicia Day out to the school just to keep it balanced in, how, in terms of how those things are done. Um... Are you saying Felicia Day has to go back to school? It's a bit <laughs> harsh. RDR, yeah, okay, I'm sending Felicia Day to the school. Uh, so I have to roll for exposure. <laughs> that wasn't a roll. <laughs> I, I hit the roll button. It was officially unbiased okay, as far as the tabletop simulator. Right, fine. so... I'll allow it. I, I, did not, I did not just dump it in the air. Um, Felicia Day goes to school. Um, it's hard to roll. Maybe I'll use that from now on. I'm also... It does stop it going off the table. It's true. I'm also... I think I'm also going to send my barricade person out. Um, do you want me to put a barricade down before... Before I go? Uh, well, I, I, I think there. what you're saying no. is you want to put a barricade down because you're a barricade person. Uh, no, no, no. James, James, put it down wherever you go because that place is going to get close to overrun. Well, yeah, but or it, overrun, I've got, depending I've got on where you send anyway, them. So I was going to fight anyway, but... Okay. So okay. The advantages no, 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 of barricades wait. over combat is not rolling for exposure, but we need to for this scenario kill zombies. That's true. Okay, good. Wound. Okay. That's okay. Wounds are fine. Uh, I mean, it's not ideal, but... X2. Did you put a barricade on the colony then? You didn't. No, I didn't. Okay. Were you going to or just not going to? I'm not going to. I'm going to put a barricade down. That was for Felicia, right? No, that one uh, was, that was for, for a construction Ashley. worker. Okay, did Felicia move? Felicia did move, yes. And she didn't get a win. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was the roll that looked like not a roll. Okay, are you killing a zombie at the library then? Uh, I um, for, Well, first I'm going to put a barricade down because just in case I die. <laughs> And then I'm going to uh, roll for 
Zombles. If you die, if you get bitten, then you're still dead. It doesn't help. Yes, but <laughs> I, that, he's I, got I, two characters there. I have someone else there. Yeah, I... and you're going to kill them if you get bitten. No, it's it's <laughs> not guaranteed. It's a, another exposure die roll, I believe. And it's a blank anyway, so it's fine. Yay. Okay, okay roll... so we have a dead zombie. Roll samples. Green dice. This green dice. <laughs> ha! We're so bad at getting samples. Okay, so that's one dice uh, down. Okay. I, I like the idea the doctors told us to get samples and we're all just like killing corpses and like butchering them and then going, oh wait, the doc did say, didn't they? <laughs> Okay, I think I'm gonna use I'm gonna use two search actions. Um, hey, who, oh yeah, um, yeah, I'm gonna use two search actions: one for my pilot and one for Felicia Day at the school. Okay. Uh, and then I'm gonna then I'll see what I've got from there and decide. I, I'll probably use Felicia Day to attack another zombie. Oh, uh, hang on, stop! Just a minute. Oh. Uh, stop! Yeah. Whose turn Sorry. is it now? Sorry. Hands off! Uh, you received a non-frostbite roll uh, wound. Um, yes. They shot me. It was no accident either. I saw them. They were all decked out in camouflage, and they had no interest in the zombies in the area. They were hunting me, I tell you what. They don't look as rough as us. They look well fed. We've got armed cannibals in our backyard. Option one, you hunt down the hunters. Option two, you don't. I think you should definitely hunt them down. Yeah, let's hunt down the hunters. Uh, oh, this is so bad. Okay. Roll for exposure twice on each survivor you control. Oh, you shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're starting with Felicia Day, are we? Yes. Okay. She's frostbite. frostbite. Shit. <laughs> Roll again. Fine. Okay, next one is Olivia Brown, the doctor. Bitten. Great. At the colony, which is not a crisis because bites don't spread at the colony, I think. Yeah, Hang but on, she's still dead, that. isn't she? Uh, spreading a bite. Do, 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 do. This was the wrong decision, James. <laughs> oh no, it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't say that not at the colony. Uh, it's just helpless survivors are automatically the lowest. Uh, okay. Great. Um, so, uh, survivor is killed and bite spreads to a helpless survivor. We can either kill the survivor or roll the exposure die again and on a blank result, um, uh, this helpless survivor survives. Uh, I think maybe we just shoot a helpless survivor. I know yeah, it sucks for our morale. So, but that's going to be two. Yeah. Takes us to three. Oof, fucking crap. Rice, James. Okay, the doctor is dead. That's both your starters. And now we're on to Sophie Robinson. Wound. wound. It's three wounds you get, yes? Yep. Yeah. And she's dead we have on to three roll wounds. Again. Yep. Blank. Okay, she's fine. And the last one, Ashley Ross. Blank. And blank okay Ooh. if it's any comfort the other half was pretty awful too for the remainder of the game whenever a player removes a survivor you roll uh die on a result of one or two uh you receive a wound so cool okay well so you've neutralized that effect joy it's on three okay uh i have to I don't have to lose a dice because I had a dice pending for Felicia Day. <laughs> uh, okay. Right, I'm going to spend my first dice searching the library. Man, that sucked. That really sucked. I'm going to use my second one searching the school. Did I take all the school ones there? No, I didn't. I just took the one. No, I did. I did take all the school cards. Oops. For Christ's sake, right-click draw. Okay. 
Okay, and I will spend my last one uh, killing a trying to kill a zombie with Felicia Day. Okay, please don't get her killed. Okay, it's Blank. Right. Yay, dead You don't zombie. have any medicine, right? No. Nope. Roll for samples. Five. Yay! Thank you, you Felicia. A sample. So we're up to five samples of the 12 we need. And we're at three morale, and we're about to get a fuck ton of zombies at the colony. <laughs> you wanted zombies at the colony. I mean, it's fine, it's just... I'm also slightly annoyed that all the weapons have landed with Stuart. We need, <laughs> we need to do something about these um, frostbites, though. Yeah, uh, I am going to mega search the hospital. Yeah, I'll keep mega searching the uh, grocery store. Okay, is that the end of it? Uh, that is... Yeah, that's my last... Okay, so we have to pay two food. We have to add... Uh, check the waste, which is fine. Resolve the crisis. Action, yes. Resolve the crisis. Twelve zombies. So we do this. Two in each location, so the barricade breaks in one. Okay, we're good. And by good, I mean royally screwed, but you know. Uh, we're out of zombies. Doug, can you copy up more? Uh, yes, I have to turn on the HUD though. There are some zombies. Drop them in the bag. Go, they won't go in the bag. Alright, locations are all zombied up. Okay, get rid of the HUD again. Okay. Cool. Next, uh, we add zombies. Which is I've gonna... added zombies to there, so it's just here. One, two, three, four, five. Going to be it's oh, four. No, four. So, so I've done it. I've done it. Done it. Done it. Done it. Check main objective. We haven't won. Pass the round tracker. Three rounds to go. Uh, how have you done token. it, Doug? How have because you done I it? took a barricade off. Barricade off here as well, though. Probably. Yeah, no, I added one there and took a barricade off here because we didn't oh, add okay, two here enough. because there were two barricades. Okay. I've okay. done it right, I promise. Okay, so it's Stuart is now the first player. New crisis time! The crisis is horror in the night. Uh, food equal to the number of non exile players fail and lose to morale. Cannot afford that. No, we can't. So we need to put three foods in there. Okay. I can do one. I can do one as well. Uh, no, well, yeah, I might be able to do one. Just okay. So should we roll up? Uh, okay, Stuart. If you need to uh, walkie-talkie, I can take a hit. Uh, I would appreciate a walkie-talkie potentially. Yes. Uh, okay. Uh, anything else we need to do before we crack on? Okay, we'll start with the immediate. Crossroads uh, for Stuart, James. Oh, yeah, crossroads, please. Uh, sure, sure. I will meet you at the crossroads, crossroads. Uh, you need to not sing. Are you worried that it was so good that someone might copyright strike you? I mean, I'm not sure what's worse, your choice of song or the vocal prowess. Crossroads, crossroads, meet you at the crossroads. Can I kick him out of the hangout? <laughs> We're good. Okay, so uh, Soldier is going to shoot two zombies and not roll for exposure because he's nice. awesome. Roll twice for samples, please. Yes! One sample. Only one sample. 
We, we are, are halfway, halfway there. Oh, oh, living on a prayer. Uh, okay, I really want to spam the hospitals, so I might just go... Uh, you need to kill a zombie there. You've got your two snipes, though. I do. I'll, I'll, I'll think about how I'm going to do that oh, in a minute. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's get another one. Uh, let's just because I can, I am going to have a look through the top four cards here. And, uh, oh, hang on, what have I got? Oh, oh that's good. Um, Sparky now has a flashlight. <laughs> 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 when making noise, you may look at three additional cards instead of one. Could you not make noise, please? You're going to get yourself killed. I mean, you cannot kill... take morale hits. Yeah, I know. But Also, your I accountant can... is at the grocery store. She should be searching for, at the grocery store so we can get some food. Like, I thought I, we wanted I... medicine. Well, we want medicine and food. Oh, um, right, I'm should, trying! Your, your dude should have taken a wound, shouldn't he? Oh, crap. Yes, he should have. Uh... Okay, that's unfortunate because I found no medicine. Uh, I did find a flashlight though. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, more actions you could rummage. I could. No, don't not rummage. I mean, search again and then rummage. I could search again and rummage now that I've got the flashlight. Well, you might get your doggy killed unless you take I two might. zombies off there. But I I can shoot a do uh, a zombie. With my doggy. You still have to roll exposure for that, right? Oh no, no you don't. don't. Excellent. Yeah, you should you should get your kill on. Okay. You're gonna shoot we're gonna shoot a zombie. Doggy's gonna shoot a zombie. Uh I'm gonna roll sample here. Nope. Okay. And then we are gonna be snip snipping. Uh we'll snip snip one from the uh grocery store. Rolling sample. Yes! Yay! Uh, anyone else got a preference for where I snip snip off one? Um, with your dog, surely. We say, oh, uh, I suppose yes, because then I can rummage. Okay. Snip snip. No sample. Balls. Okay. One, and then we're going to put one rummage. And you get three. And I get... For your flashlight. Yeah. But you only get to keep one of those. I do. And you could keep it in your hand, and then my pirate could steal them from you. Uh, let's not do that. Why not? Uh, it's there. Arts have gone under my hand for some reason. I think you might have to put them into your hand individually. Maybe you only get to keep one of those four. I know. Food or medicine, guys? Uh, you should get medicine and get rid of that frostbite. Yeah. If you don't, the guy dies. I know, I know. It's... And that's a morale hit. I couldn't give two shits about your guy, but it's a morale hit. Plus, how much Felicia morale do we have? Yeah. Why is Felicia Day going to die? <laughs> if we <laughs> fail... I, I have no way to get medicine to her easily. <laughs> The thing I'm worried about, Doug, is if we fail the food, that's too morale. Yes, this is true. I have our food and the grocery store. Uh, okay, so if you're confident that you can do it... I mean, I'm not uh, confident, no. Uh, well, then should I do the food? I mean, your guy's going to die if you do. Uh, but somebody oh, else... I'll take the... I, I've got a low-value food card, so I'll play that if Douglas... But I've hardly got any cards, so I'd appreciate if Douglas doesn't steal from me. <laughs> I'm not going to steal from you. The pirate is not going back to the base to steal. Okay, Nobody's then I'll, going to the I'll, base. I'll do one food. You you can do medicine, and then we just need one food from our collectiveness. At this point, honestly, I, I would put food two and food three into the crisis contribution to try and get the morale up. Well, I've got food one, so... Yeah, no, I know, but that's what I'm saying, is that for the grocery store, um, if I could get the morale plus one, then I will do it. Uh, 
So you should I... Today's food. Okay, <laughs> so I'm taking, I'm taking the medicine. Okay, you're using the medicine immediately? Uh, yes. I would like to use the medicine immediately, and that goes away. So the other thing you could do with Felicia, James, so she could get a medicine at the school, or you could run to the hospital. You'd have to kill a zombie. Kill a zombie, and yeah, and I'd have to roll for exposure. At that point, I think the and I'd end up risking just as much. Uh, I could. Well, you might take the dog a, with you. I can give you a card. Which would be funny. Uh, uh, James, I could give you a card, and then you wouldn't have to roll for exposure for the movement. How could you give me a card? I think you can just trade cards, can't you? Yeah, from your hand to their hand, if you have a survivor in the same location. Which we do. We have... Uh, uh, do you have anybody at the colony? No. Oh, maybe we don't. Oh, you're all on your own. Well, fuck you then. Sorry. Do we? No, we don't. No, that's what I'm saying. No, we don't. So fuck you. <laughs> Sorry. Do you have anyone at the colony, James? I do not know. My only person at the colony was the doctor, and the doctor died. Because okay. apparently my character The doctor you refused, you refused to move out into the dangerous bit where people were getting wounded to treat people because you thought they would die, got killed at the colony. Yes, yes, I see the irony. <laughs> Just say it, for fuck's sake. Okay. Come on. Uh, Stuart, it's still... Are you finished? Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, discard crossroads. And then I draw crossroads for James. Uh, remember the Felicia Day thing? Uh, yep. Felicia's not at the colony, right? No. Okay. Wait, we are doing this in the right order, right? Well, uh, I was reading James's cards before, but it's fine. But you read, <laughs> uh, James read yours just now. There you go, you can have oh. it. You can have a look. It's fine. Okay, okay, never mind. <laughs> right, okay. Okay, I am not going to be moving anybody anywhere. Okay, so... I'll start with, I get my free barricade. Oh, that's good. Hmm. Can I suggest you just do a ton of searching for Felicia? Because otherwise she's going to die. And we can't have Felicia Day die. The <laughs> internet will hate you. Yeah, okay, so I'll do... Uh, uh, once... Didn't she have a wound? She has a frostbite. Oh yeah, she should have a wound now for a frostbite. Oh yes, you're right. One more and she dies. That would be bad. Okay, I will search the school. Okay. You should only have four dice, James. Um, what? Why? I've got three survivors. That's yeah, true. Four, four dice. Where, where, where's the... One dice for each survivor and one for yourself. Yes, but I only had four. That one isn't my dice. Oh, well, it is yes, now. Yes, it is. Well, it's now. Fine, okay. Uh, if the grey dice was yours, then that should be a three. I don't think it matters. There you go. Fine. Sorted. <laughs> yeah, I ditched my other purple dice. Somebody apparently gave me another one. Uh, okay, I will search the uh, library because I get to do that for the. Did you get a medicine? Uh, I did not. No. Get get a medicine. Uh, okay, I'm gonna. When you play a medicine, can you play it on someone else? I'm gonna do one. Uh... Remove any type of wound from a survivor you control or remove any type of wound token from a uh, have to share a location. Okay, so if I find a medicine, you have to go to Felicia. I will come and save you. Because uh, okay. you are Felicia Day. How would we feel about expanding the colony, boys? <laughs> no! <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying it's a possibility, right? <laughs> Oh my god, you traitorous piece of shit. James is a fucking cult leader. <laughs> Keeps getting more and more and more characters and then getting them killed off. Okay, so I have... Um, 
I have two dice left, but they're my high value dice. I can do basically anything I like. Um, Search for more medicine. The rummage rules, it's per location, not per character, right? Yes. So I can't, yeah, I can't do that. Uh, okay. And if I search uh, at the location again, I get the rummage noise, and that means that we get an no, extra no, no. You can search as many times as you want. What rummaging does is it gives you an additional option. So a, a standard rummage is you then see two and choose one card, but you get to choose to rummage after you see the first card. Oh, so I can just search again, and there's no yeah. additional. Yeah, 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 yeah. Search okay. as many times as you want. Okay. Um, or as I'll many search. times you have dice. I'll search school again. And just so you're aware, rummaging creates a fifty-fifty chance of uh, causing another zombie. Yeah. Uh, guys, how, are you sure we're not okay with having more survivors? <laughs> hey, like in Dragon, welcome to the game. Apparently, James is collecting humans. <laughs> I mean, I mean, let's face it. If my characters start dying, I'm just going to start summoning more characters at this point. Um, James, James, I couldn't. Like, the internet is going to hate you if you kill Felicia Day. Like, that's a given. But also, you can't tank our morale. We have three morale. Okay. Uh, this is why you end up in jail. You kill everyone. Okay, right. Uh, okay, one more then. This is the last shot on that. Medicine, medicine, medicine. That was the triumphant sound of James getting medicine. <laughs> no. Um, do you have any food ones, Douglas? Yes. One. And, uh, Okay, then you can you you can finish off the crisis contribution. I've got a food too. Um, uh, might be worth it for the extra morale. I mean, I'm gonna try and get more food from the grocery store. Can can you put it in because that will guarantee a success? And if I can get two more cards, then I'll get plus one morale, which we're gonna need because you're killing everyone. <laughs> not killing everyone. It's not <laughs> my fault. Cannibals killed everyone. And Chat my... says, James says to the police at location, what were you doing at the scene of the crime? I was uh, collecting more humans. <laughs> yep. When he should have been collecting samples of the corpses. I mean, come on, please. We don't want the living one, James. Okay. So, uh... my turn. James, draw a crossroads for me, please. How are we doing? We're doing all right. Um, aside from our morale problem, we are doing okay in this game so far. We haven't seen anybody do anything particularly traitorous yet. So that's good. I mean... You got the crossroads set, James? How many do we need? I do, yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Five more. I'm, I'm wondering if maybe I pull back and I just focus on spam killing. I mean, that's what I'm intending to do, but I'm going to try and get a medicine for him. Because I'm yeah. going to try and get the food anyway. Okay, here is our food for the crisis. That means we've got three cards in the crisis. <laughs> no, James, no more people. <laughs> okay, first off, grocery store. Search. Okay, I'm going to equip uh, the woodsman with a hammer. Which allows him to build more barricades. Uh, right. So. Did not get a medicine. Uh, oh, damn, James. There's no other way to heal. I, uh, I'm going to draw. Go to the grocery store twice more. Uh, once more. Once more. You're right. Uh, did you play your uh, Lucky Luke Smith I did ability? not. Five or six to get a free card from somewhere. Yes. No. Okay, this is my search. Okay. I really want to get plus one morale. I need to have him... Move or kill. Move or kill. Okay. You can also search. The exciting reality show. Yeah. Move or kill! <laughs> and I want the sheriff to kill... I get to kill two zombies and only roll once. Nice. So the sheriff is going to do that on a... Okay, so I'm going to do that first. I'm going to roll exposure for the sheriff. And it's a blank. So I'm going to take off 
two zombies from here. We're going to roll for samples twice. Nice, nice. we got one sample. Two samples. Oh, we can finish this next round. We can definitely finish this next round. Okay. Who scores it first next round, James? Is... Shit, we're going to have such a morale mm. problem. Okay, well, I guess the pirate's got to kill someone, otherwise he's going to die. Rolling don't exposure. Die, don't die, don't die. Blank. Roll for samples. More samples! Yes! Give me those samples. Okay. One, two, you still don't have much four, in the way of weapons, do you, Doug? Seven, eight, no. nine, ten. Okay, ten. Well, I'm going to do two kills. I'm going to get four kills just off my abilities. Um... So statistically, that should give us two. Given how dog shit we've been rolling, let's assume one. Um... Okay, then I'm going to search again. Where are you searching? The grocery store. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. Bosh. Bosh. You managed to load it up with enough to give us the plus one. Yep. At your turn over? No idea what this game is. So yeah, uh, this is this is a board game about the zombie apocalypse. One of us may be a traitor, and all of us are probably gonna die. We're making it right out. Nice. Especially Felicia Day. Especially Felicia Day. Yes. Okay. At, at your turn over, Doug. Uh, yeah, that's my turn over. Um, I am so gutted because the card that I am holding at the moment has on it the words. When winter tries to trap you there, mount up on a polar bear. <laughs> Why is it with me and bears? <laughs> Doug, accept it. The game knows you're a bear botherer. <laughs> I didn't do anything to any bears. Although, um, hang on, isn't it? I have a bear sound alert. I think that's the one. That's not the right one. Never mind. No, I'm that's a dragon. Imagine, Dragons no. are not bears. <laughs> I was just imagining. Oh, okay. Well, he... here's here's the other one. Sure. Why not? He was a bear of a man. <laughs> right. Okay. Thank okay. you for that. I guess. So, uh, I think the bear one might only go off if I get raided. Okay, so that was the round, yeah? That's the last of the us. Yes. Well, thank you for the follow, Lycan Dragon. We're setting off setting off all the uh, all the sound alerts right now. <laughs> <laughs> Stalin got a follow, yeah. So first off, Stalin's the draw. <laughs> Stalin even more than you, James. Uh, two food. Okay. Uh, Stuart, can I ask a favour? Mm -hmm. I haven't satisfied my victory condition yet. Okay. I should be able to next turn. Okay. So you can go okay. nuts with the killing next turn. I can do killing. I can do all the killing. Yeah, I'm saying I, don't I, do it now. I haven't satisfied my victory condition. Oh. oh, well, I don't have a shot this turn. I was first. It's going to be next turn. Anyway. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine then. Right. I've paid two food. Um... We need 12 for the victory condition, yeah? Yes. We should be able to get two next Deck turn. Waste. No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. Waste. Resolve crisis. Cards have been shuffled. Okay, let's hope these are all foods. Uh, did I put in one too many? I put in one too many. You shitter. Oh, well. <laughs> okay, so we gain a morale. Not only did when, I put in one too many, the one I put in too many, <laughs> it was a food too. Uh, no, it's food cards, not food, isn't yes, it? Yes, I know, but I put a food two in there. Right, but it's food cards. It's food yes, I know, food. but we put in six food cards when we needed five, and one of them oh. was a food two. Well, that's really shit then. It's Don't fine. Don't do that. Don't worry about it. Uh, so the... when, you, when you play badly, it generally means that you're traitoring. You do it deliberately. Uh, so we've resolved the crisis. Add zombies. Uh, okay. Uh, so we I'll... have one on the police station, two on the grocery store. I've done the colony. 
One on the school, one on the library, but that's a broken barricade. One on here, plus on uh, four plus. Yay! Sparky. Was safe. Sparky, Not that it matters. Sparky MVP. is going to kill everything. How should I mean, you I resolve gonna... ties? Uh, I don't know. It's very difficult to know without knowing, like, uh, theme of game. Uh, rock, paper, scissors. There's your, there's your arbitrary answer. But you have to play the music from Alex Kidd in Miracle World. <laughs> Yelling. <laughs> That's how you resolve ties. Okay, pass the first player marker. Uh, we'll move, remove the crisis and new crisis is blizzard uh, I can do a fuel uh, non-exiled survivors cannot move until the end of next round lose one morale I think we just go for killing and not worry about the morale right uh, we still we, we have to survive yeah but we have four morale that's true yeah okay Near future post-apocalyptic motor racing. Oh my god. You had my interest with every single word in that sentence. <laughs> nice. Uh, uh, ability to quote Mad Max lines as a tiebreaker? Okay, James, it's your turn. Um, I think the first thing that's going to happen... Well, Stuart's going to draw a crossroads card. And then Felicia Day is going to die. <laughs> yeah, Felicia Day is going to die. <laughs> no! Uh, Have you got three. the crossroads card, Stuart? I do. Does it say if Felicia Day is about to die, save her? Uh, that's an interesting question. <laughs> Does so, it say that or not? Uh, well... I guess, technically... This card attaches to Felicia, and then she dies. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> so, oh, it's uh, Olivia Brown. Yeah. Oh, what does it say? So. Let me get this. Oh, straight. she. Want... Olivia can experiment. Oh. What? You want to endanger the whole colony so you can probe a zombie or something? Felicia... I mean, that's the entire scenario. Oh, don't be jealous, she snaps. But yes, I want to study one of the undead. I might be able to find a simple ways to protect us from the virus. Place Felicia at the colony. This does not count as a move. Each player with one or more survivors at the colony must vote for a thumbs up or thumbs down. Attach this card to Felicia. Doesn't matter, she blah, dies. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, so. So Felicia could have done experiments as an actress. <laughs> she is yeah. very skilled at pretending to be a doctor. But uh, instead she dies. Our doctor wasn't very much good at pretending to be a doctor. Well, you did not let her. Go she was. She doctor. was a better doctor than the ninja was a ninja. Okay, <laughs> we lost the morale because Felicia Day died. The ninja at least. James, went what have somewhere. you done? What have you done? <laughs> James, the... you you you've got two people left, and you had the most people. <laughs> I think he has had three people die now. Mike Joe the ninja, Olivia guess. Brown the doctor, and Felicia Day the actress all died at James's hands. Okay. <laughs> this can is I why you go to jail. The, can I double check the rules on this? If we res if we've met the victory condition, does it matter if we? Um... The victory condition is the very last thing we check. No, it isn't. It's colony phase, pay food, check waste, resolve crisis, add zombies, check main objective. If we get to zero morale before we go to that check main objective thing, then we lose. Doug, the other two things are move the round tracker and pass the first player token. It's essentially the last thing we check. Sure. <laughs> okay, right. So, uh, my turn, yes? Yes. Right. Um, so we add zombies between there, so I need to kill someone in this library. Uh, you need to right? kill two someones in that library. I get a free barricade if I kill someone and make space for it. Okay, fine. Okay, uh, okay, so I'm uh, I haven't to... rolled. Did we roll? Oh, uh, I haven't rolled either. No. I have rolled. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Oh, like shit, Doug. Oh, it's terrible. Okay, are we oh, ready? Brilliant. Yep. Uh, what can I do with that? Uh, absolutely fucking nothing. Blank! Blank, yay! Oh, no, he can kill. Okay. That's so you're bad. killing a zombie at the library. 
I kill a zombie and in the library roll for with samples. the lead piping. No sample. Uh, you... No sample. Well, Damn. Shit. I, I've taken it off, the one you put on. Okay. Uh... <sighs> I'll do one. Okay, I'll, I'll get my free barricade. Presumably at the library. Uh, yes, because I have nobody anywhere else. Donde estas la biblioteque? <laughs> Uh, if you want yeah, to barricade the zombie bonely. slot rather than the people slot. <laughs> yep. Right. Um, is there any benefit to me getting an extra survivor just to help do something at the colony? No. No. <laughs> you just cost us food. Yeah, but we've got spare food. We've got three in the supply. Sure, and if got... he if he plays a survivor, I'm exiling. We him. exile him. Oh come on! No, I no, I'm you can... friendly. James, nope. you have had three of your survivors die, and your remainder one remaining ones both have wounds. Can we? You can we what? just say you cannot be trusted with people? I'm not only exiling you. I'm using my guns to attack your characters. Exile is a kind of jail. You know, I said that at the beginning of the game. <laughs> <laughs> Draw. Fine. Uh, the so problem that's... with exiling him if he is not a betrayer is that he will get a an objective to win the game that is quite betray which we don't What's really it? want. Okay, and I'll draw again. Go. So we can only we'll win if we don't lose two more morale, and we get enough samples because it is random. Yes, we should uh, be able to do enough killing that statistically we should, but the dice do hate us. <laughs> I mean, they seem to hate James uh, more than anything. <laughs> well, they do hate me quite a lot. Yes, this is true. Um, that exposure die in particular. Right, I do have a crisis contribution thing, though. Why? Nice. I thought we were trying. Are we? Okay, fine. I mean, I'm not, well, but sure, do what you want. Well, I, I have nothing else to do with it, so... I can't I mean, hand it off because I'm not in the same location as anyone else. Fine, put it there. I don't care. Go for it. I don't have any actions to do. What? Am I, I, basically, it's pointless unless I put it in here because that means that maybe you can get enough fuel to keep morale from going down. Fine. Uh, is that your turn? Uh, that would be my turn, yes. Okay. Uh, draw a crossroads for me, please. Uh, yes. Yeah, all mine. Uh, hang on. Did we have ten waste? No. Uh, no. We had eight. Okay, that's yeah. fine. I think we still have eight. We need, to, we need to keep tabs on that. Well, I do have a one die, so I can pick it up, because that's yeah. kind of worthless. Okay. Let's uh, who do you control, Douglas? Uh, oh, no, it's all right. Daniel Smith, Greybeard, Andrew Evans, and Kodiak Colby. We're good. Colby. It's all right. I don't need to know. Okay, so uh, I'm going to have Greybeard kill a zombie. <sighs> that looked like a bite for a second. Uh, really did. Roll for samples. Fuck! Should I try for more samples? I kind of probably need to do this. What is... Oh, you need a... Uh... What's your magic search thing? Roll a dice. Roll a die at the beginning of the turn for a magic search. Here we go. Nope. nope. You're useless, Lucky Luke Smith. Lucky my arse. Uh... I need a four plus to kill zombies at the thing. So I'll do that. Oop. Blank. So we kill two zombies at the uh, base, the colony. I'll roll tw or can you roll for samples? Oh, I'll roll for samples, there we go. One sample. Hey. One sample only. We need one more sample. One more sample and we have done it. Okay, so we need to kill two zombies at the grocery store. Uh, I can and take one care zombie of that at the police station. You could, or I uh... could. If you could do one, that would be great, because... To... Um, I haven't way, searched I yet. And you I... could, if you do one... You need to, um... If you need to do searching, that's okay. Um, okay, I'm going to play a junk to re-roll one of these twos. Okay. 
now I can search and kill. So I'm going to search first. Could do a James move. Uh, we're good on food, right? Okay. Uh, I'm going to have the farmer kill a zombie. It's a blank. And is it a sample? It's no sample. <laughs> I love the fact that this is probably going to go down, uh, come down to a dog, a heavily armed dog taking scientific samples. <laughs> uh, Daniel Smith can kill another zombie for two, or the pirate can kill a zombie for two. The Sparky pirate... is a good girl. She bring you corpses when you ask. Uh, I'm going to kill another zombie. Roll for exposure. That's a bite, right? Yeah. That looks like a bite. Yeah, that's a dead pirate. Okay, yeah. uh, sample. Yes. Hey, you've completed the objective. I have. I don't even need to bother killing. Just put up a barricade in the uh, in the grocery store. Rather Sorry, Greybeard just... the pirate. It would be nice if we bookended this game with a ninja dying and a pirate dying. Okay, we cannot lose any more morale. Okay. So do safe things, please, Stuart. Right. Uh, let's start. If he's the with... betrayer, we're fucked. Uh, uh, draw your crossroads first. Oh, yeah, somebody draw a crossroads for me, will I've you? Got it. Uh, I'm going to search the hospital. Uh, I'm going to wait a minute. Okay, you do not. Okay. Uh, I am going to rummage at the hospital. Why are you doing this? Oh, do you need something for your thing? I am going to rummage at the hospital. Yes, my plan is to run away. Don't panic. Okay. <laughs> I am going to rummage. Oh my god, Stuart. <laughs> I'm, it's fine. You've got I'm more going search actions. Away. I am going to rummage at the hospital. <laughs> Did you take your extra bonuses for flashlight rummage? Oh, I didn't. So that would be no rummages. because Well, it would be one rummage and I would have got these three cards. Yes. As I say, Doug, my plan is to run away, so it is irrelevant how many... Yeah, and you can't I die get. because you are you only take a wound. If you get a frostbite, you're fine still. Yeah, so it is... I am not an idiot. You're just it trying to fulfill your condition. It's entirely safe for me to rummage. Okay. Uh, and... Uh, Did you get the thing you need? Uh, you could have also asked me what you needed. I could have, but, you know... Uh, so those go back in and get shuffled. Into the uh, the pool. Yes. Good. Uh, I'm going to search the hospital. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Stuart. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? I'm going to rummage at the hospital. Ah. Okay. <laughs> Do we need to exile him? We can't. I am going to rummage at the hospital. Is he trying to kill his dog? <laughs> I am going to rummage at the hospital. Okay, we're still fine on waste. Ah, uh, that's really annoying. Uh, what do you need? Uh, I need a medicine. I wish you told me that. Oh, can you give me a wet medicine? Yes, but not on your turn. Oh. Can't I? Uh, hang on, let me check. Uh, request. Mm -hmm. Can you request things from me? Request. May request one or more items. Yes. Would you like a medicine? I would love a medicine. Here you go. Oh, thank you very much. Do you know what? I'm going to do something... Okay. Uh, that is very kind of you. I appreciate that. Uh, I will put all of these back. Sure's going to be the betrayer, isn't he? Uh, there we go. Do that. And that. That dog better fucking run now. 
Uh, look, he's got, he did, he did, I wasn't planning on keeping this, but he did find a mop so we can come back and clean the waste nicely. <laughs> sure, okay, fine, you're gonna send a dog with a mop. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Heavily let... armed janitor dog. Let's, right. Uh, bur burn a fuel and get the dog home so he's safe. Okay, fine. You need to clean the waste, uh, you need to snipe two zombies as well, please. Yes. Okay, let's, uh, no, he's but, betraying. I, I'm fairly certain he's betraying. He's stacking up the waste. and no, He's and trying he's to fulfill his victory condition, I think. I don't know if he's uh, betraying or not. I'm going to, because I'm going to clean the waste anyway, I'm going to re-roll this dice so that I've got something decent. <laughs> nope. Let's go again. Let's go again. Hang on. Stuart. This is there not acceptable. So All right. Awesome. Uh, you only uh, needed a one to clean the waste, you idiot. <laughs> yeah. If I was gonna do that oh, uh, God. yeah i told you he's betraying <laughs> search the grocery store shall we um, do you want to know what's worse than this you know that medicine that i had i had it for a while yeah yeah could have saved felicia couldn't you i absolutely could have saved felicia it may be part of my victory condition that i didn't want to do that <laughs> oh you're the traitor light no, I don't need everyone to die. Just three people. Yeah. That's... Okay, so the traitor is going to... So can we establish that you've made everything traitorous now? Yeah, there's enough waste that you've won. Yeah, I know, but let's just... Uh... Oh, look at that. There's some more medicine for me. I'll have that. Okay. Yes, yes. Get on with it. <laughs> okay. Uh, I... I think that should result in enough death that uh, the morale goes down. You know what? Just just for the lols, I'm going to shoot two zombies. There you go. Because uh, I'm awesome like that. Cool. Okay. Uh, my turn's done. Okay. Well, I guess we lose because of the waste. So the waste is at 12. That costs us a morale. We uh, failed the crisis. That's Gabriel, morale. So Gabriel let's have a quick dies. look at our objectives then. Uh, and my objective died, was revenge. Died. I need the main objective to be completed, and at least three survivors were removed from the game. We had four. Sorry, Felicia Day. <laughs> what was your <laughs> objective? My objective was historian. I needed the main objective to be completed and have at least two oh, uh, documents. That's where you were cards. going to the bloody library all the time. What was Stuart? He has three medicines and uh, an adrenaline shot. Accept your fate. You wanted morale to be zero. You have at least two weapons. You have at least three medicine cards. Okay. Uh, it's better than that. It's two weapons equipped to a survivor I control, which is Sparky, which means this is this is Sparky speaking. Okay, right. Only the... now, only now do you all understand the doom that laid upon your our species. I tried to. <laughs> I'm going to change that. Sorry, I'm going to change that. <laughs> only now do you all understand the doom laid upon your species. I tried to tell you it was hopeless, but I guess you wanted to squander what was left of your lives on hard labor. The colony was just a child's daydream. Surely in your hearts you knew it wasn't sustainable. Nothing could be in the face of complete annihilation. The dead will always keep coming, and the few of us left on this planet will always be swelling their ranks. It is best to go and seek death now, in a manner more fitting for you. Me? I shall lie just here and wait. To do anything else would be embarrassingly pointless. Woof. <laughs> I hope you get eaten by a zombie bear. So uh, you're all kicked out of the colony. At gunpoint. By a dog. And Sparky the Wonder Dog uh, rules the colony. No, Sparky the Wonder Dog shoots up and waits to die in a blissed out opioid <laughs> storm. Pretty much, yeah. What? Uh, you're the worst. Yeah. <laughs> What's that, Lasso? Life is pointless and bleak? <laughs> you are the absolute worst. All right. Let's the see. The traitors on this are just vicious. They yeah, are. I think playing the hard a hard mode traitor with only three players is kind of brutal. Well, it especially is. with revenge, which is essentially traitor light. Yeah, well, I mean, I didn't honestly do anything traitory. Like James, I was just letting him do his work. 
The only one that I did was that I did have medicine to, to save Felicia Day. I could have saved Felicia Day. Also, wasn't the condition... You hear that, internet? Oh, no, you got the pirate killed, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, by, that, yeah by so, that I, point, I mean, I could have no done that anyway. To... The question then is, how many morale did you sink us at the end? One oh. for the waste. Uh, one for the waste. Uh, firemen got killed. Both folk at the grocery store will almost certainly have got killed on the rummages. Uh, yeah, so you had enough. I think that was it. Oh, and the... Um, crisis, too. Yeah. It's why I was encouraging people to go for the crisis, because then you would have been like, oh, we're safe, and I could have done a... No, you're not. Yeah, I should have been stacking up more morale because I knew that I had to cause death. Mm. All right. Yeah, well, like I said, you'd have been okay if Stuart wasn't the traitor. Oh, yes. But that's okay. always the way with the traitor. <laughs> I am going to throw a spicy raid, and then we're going to check out uh, if that is all right. Thank you for stopping by thank you for the follows and the starlings and the good shit uh i'm gonna throw a raid on someone else who is playing tabletop simulator or something so that should be fun good night Bye, everybody bye-bye